Yes! This specifically reminds me when I was on uh, Mushrooms. Look, I'm just saying, like, I feel like a world like that in D&D has to exist. The Plane of Chaos? Yeah. I don't I mean, feel like it'd move as fast, but it certainly would have warped like this a lot. Yeah, so, like, imagine everything slowly turning into something else vaguely similar. Like, that's... That's how I imagine it being. Well, mm, I'm ready to... Ninja, you didn't approve my plan, so I didn't guess her no. I don't know which plan are we talking about. Ah, uh, so it has the... It's been a long the time. The one I had a long session. time ago. I, I know, yeah, I know. Because my somebody? job has just been like... How you been? Nah. What you been up to? Oh, Lord. I, I look right. back at this. Are you caught up? <laughs> you have fun with are you, that. Are you caught up, Hesky? I will have fun with that. On? No fucking clue, but I will find out. We're in Darum. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Am I caught up? No. <laughs> We're in Darm, where everyone's super racist against all the different races. Basically, the Imperium of Man. Look, I just want to point out, like, Framor is racist in the, like, subtle ways of, like, we'll do some shit to you in a back alley if we get the chance. But, like, we won't openly do shit. Darm's like the, hey, fuck you. <laughs> You're not one of us. You don't share our blood. You don't share our bond. But I do. Fuck you. <laughs> but I do. Fuck. By the way, I have a an item that I picked up from work, uh, like that somebody dropped off for recycling. That looks like suspiciously looks like a gun. Like suspiciously like a gun. Like it's got a a underbarrel flashlight and everything. I, I'm gonna try and take a photo of it so I can send it. You know what I really want to go to right now? Not darn. Uh, no, in real life. A oh, Dagnir. Right. A Dagnir event. I have no idea what that is. Uh, imagine LARP, but you have like 50 people, and there's actually a weapon system to decide what kind of weapon you have and how many of said weapon you can have. Like white, green, and blue, and red weapons. Red weapons, you can you have to two-hand. Blue weapons are can two-hand or one-hand. Green weapons are one-handed, and white weapons are like rocks full of foam that you can throw up. Well, you can have as many of those as you want. Just decking somebody with a fucking rock of foam. And there's like a point system on where you get hit. Here, I'll send you a video that you Because my buddy showed me this. Alright, so... In the funny stuff. Like, come on now. <laughs> Tell me that ain't a gun. So tiny, what do you think? That's what I think about what? Uh, the thing I posted, in, yeah. The thing that absolutely looks like a gun. I mean, it is absolutely a glue gun. It's not a glue like... gun. The fuck is it, then? The fuck is that? <laughs> Hello? It's a fucking screwdriver type, like, electric drill. So, like, you can, oh, ro okay. you can rotate the handle so that it's, like, straight. And it looks more like a, uh, like a uh, regular, like, electric screwdriver, but the handle just turns and it looks like a gun. <laughs> like, complete with light and everything, and I'm like, this is fucking retarded, I love it. <laughs> Here we go, let me send you this ninja, because I, I, this, this looks fun. Also, hey, Faye. I feel like I've seen this before. This, this looks like the place where, uh, how does the grass taste, tiny man, would originate from. That's a weird thing. 
Uh, look, have, have you seen that, uh, that video? How does the grass taste out of I don't know, let me see what video it is. Uh, I don't have it on hand, but it's literally, like, two knights duking it out, and, uh, the one rushes the other and just shield bashes the guy charging, and, like, just on the ground, and he gloats over, it's like, how does the grass taste, tiny man? I have the video you want, Andrew, right? Yes! He's posting it's... it in general. <laughs> it's such a fucking hilarious video. Tell me how the grass tastes, little man. <laughs> That's known as a dick move. <laughs> Look, I'm just saying. The thing you sent me absolutely looks like it would originate some kind of content like that. I'm just saying. To be fair, uh, to be same, fair same, look how big energy, that fucking dude is, that. bro. Like, he knew he could knock that guy down. That guy's fucking huge. <laughs> Yeah, but still, it's great. Look, I'm also gonna be real. I'm very much a uh, an archery kind of guy. There are bows in Dagnir. Uh, yeah, I know. I know. I've I've seen this kind of place. Uh, I've always wanted to go to one, but I don't know wherever they hold them. Especially like within the last two years, because my friend told me about. It. I was like, "What the fuck? That sounds fun." Oh wait, fuck. We're supposed. Uh... I wasn't here when we leveled up to level 11, and y'all were like, yeah, we're supposed to be level 11 now, and I was gonna do it after last week's session, and then fucking forgot. Nice. Oh, yeah, I have to change that, too. You have what to level are you, <laughs> Tiny? I'm probably level 9. I'm level 10. Tiny hasn't been uh, here in a while. I'm gonna go get my snacks real quick. Alright. Let me see here. Let me, let me look it up. Let me look, it, let me look that shit up. Oh, by the way, Faye, you won't believe what I was doing today. What were you doing today? Lord oh, I'm level online. eight. You're level eight. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm not level nine. I'm level eight. dead rog. Oh jeez. That's uh, uh, what do you play again? Here, uh, class. Warlock. Warlock. E. You have some nice stuff. It's fine. You can continue to be level eight if you want. You have a point, actually. Very good one. Guys, I know we're going <laughs> up against the big boss, but I've only got 10 HP. Whack! Oh, well, I'm dead. <laughs> Whack. I don't feel so good. Mr. Cryer, I mean, all uh, feels so hold, good. hold up. We, we can actually do this scene. Uh, what is it? Finger of Death? Oh, yeah. I get the, the next level of Destroy oh. Undead. Sweet. Nice. For a single moment, I have 69 hit points. That's about oh, to change. So... And I get one six level spell slot, which means I have to put in all the goddamn spells for six level. So, Finger of Death is great. It, it doesn't do the disintegration that I want, but I still love Finger of Death. Uh, it's the one where you literally, if you kill somebody, they just turn into a zombie for you. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah, so, disintegrate. One level lower, you can literally just obliterate a creature if you kill them. Nice. A disintegrated creature and everything it's wearing and carrying, except for magic items, are reduced to a pile of fine gray dust. What is my new page computer? I need to double check. <sighs> How's everyone been done? Yeah, I've been good. Yeah, I've been alright. Good. Oh, that's right. <laughs> We're too yeah. busy venting, oh my god. I know my mechanics, despite never playing the game. Hello. Hello. 
We're calling oh, Sophie sus. Is. Be fair. Hestia? A lot of it's memed. Yes. I thought you were dead. Ah, she did die. That's missing. She's taking over the world. It's my eye. My oh, death dear. was greatly exaggerated. Oh, you're working with stone? <laughs> my, my death was greatly exaggerated. <laughs> Shut Look, the fuck up. I just recently watched an entire uh, video essay on that fucking movie. It's like, oh, I forgot how good this was. Uh, some of us are currently leveling up. Yes. Because as we're behind. As it turns uh, out. You guys were level 11 while I was level 8. Yeah, yeah sounds about right, considering how long you were gone. Yep. By the way, Ninja, real quick. Yep. Did you give a look over to that feed I sent you? I'm probably not going to allow it. Uh, for what reason? Uh, I decided not to. I, 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 mean, just, I was enough. waiting for the beginning, because <laughs> I'm the deal. <laughs> Look, I will say those are the first words that crossed my mind, but I then decided to I, I'm not, immediately change I'm not it. I'm not bitching about it. I, I'm simply asking reasoning, that's all. I mean, I feel like somehow it'll break the game, and I just haven't figured it out yet. <laughs> I mean, literally the only reason that I want this is due to, to being able to take the dashed action as a bonus action without multiplassing into Rogue. Look, have I and got a substance news. for you? It's called cocaine. And good news. The fact that he says he's worried he break the game, but he doesn't know how, means you might be able to later convince him that it won't break the game. Listen, there, the, there is no thing in this game that is going to stop Tatavi from being able to run at at least 100 miles an hour. Uh, you'll, like, pull your skin off or something good? Wait, 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 I have a name for this. <laughs> I mean, by mechan simply by mechanics, I'm able to do it. So, you know, it's just up to Ninja to see how far this goes. Which, considering the fact that all I really want to do is move fast, I don't think he's going to have too much of an issue with it due to the fact you that won't won't be the won't come back. Uh, I could, depending on what happens. If I hear a meet me, I know who it comes from. Uh, well, yes. I actually meet did me. design a certain uh, set of circumstances where I could potentially move at Mach 3.5. Oh, please. That's been around for a while now. Yes, I know. I'm trying to find the exact, like, image I want, and I can't find are you, it. Are you sure Shit. it's not already Wait, a happened? feat that can't give you a bonus action dash? Oh, Real 20, we're doing this game again. I found Where it. you go to paste a description for a spell, and then immediately after you paste it, it's like, oops! That wasn't there, and just erases it. It's like, oh, thanks. Mm. No problem. <sighs> oh, there isn't one. Huh. There really is There's one. Huh. There you go, Zach. Unlucky. <laughs> Every time I level up, I have to fight with that, with it just made randomly being like, ah, oh, we're gonna undo what you just put in. Oh, oh wait a sec. Oh, wait a fucking second. Now you're starting to talk like that fucking hunter that hunts Bugs Bunny. Can't remember his name. God damn it. Elmer Fudd. Yeah. Where are those spells? You know, the good news is, is that my dress is probably looking pretty spiffy by now. I like how you assume somebody's just been working on it this entire time. I know. <laughs> I just love that that's the assumption. That's the hope. Like, I don't have hope. No, no, like, more specifically, it's like, I didn't pay for extra, but if I haven't picked up this item yet, maybe they'll Ugh. keep working on it. It's like, that's, that's not how this works, man. I mean, it's not. But at the same time, they got as much time as they wanted for it. I still need to go back for my tooth belt. Yep. I need to be able to accessorize. Nah, the thing that I messaged you a long time ago, that was the real thing I wanted to be doing. Oh, I know. I, I am well aware of this. Good. 
Where was that spell list? Damn it. Hey, Hestia. Tell me what you want. What you really, really want. Power. <laughs> nice. No, you're supposed to be like, I'll tell you what you want. What you really, really want? No. Oh, power. No, but Hestia did it the really exact want. way Hestia would. Tell me what you want. What you really, really want. Power. <laughs> yeah, that's boring. Exactly. <laughs> Oh, hey. so you're saying Hestia is boring? Yes. How dare you. <laughs> fight How me. fucking dare you. I will fight you, bitch. I, I do it. <laughs> I will fight you, god. Just, oh, give, just give me, like, nine more levels, alright? Alright, alright. Yeah, 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 sure. Hello. I, I'm just gonna say, you missed Thrallmart, so, you know, who's the real loser? You right. dead. Close enough. Mm -hmm. Now we just await the other two. The smoochers. It gives me time to do things I should have already had. What the fuck was that? Nothing. It sounded like a ray gun. Honestly. <laughs> Okay, then. <laughs> I'll give you oh more God. credit if you can establish where it's from. Star Wars. Yes. So, because my dad and I are absolute children some days, he got me a, uh, like, the Nerf Han Solo blaster, and he got nice. one for himself. So, it's always fun when we come over to each other's places. I'm now imagining y'all having a little battle, and then afterwards, going to eat, and he's like, Oh, no, no, no. I'll just eat these crackers and cheese. I mean, you're not that far away. I'm on a diet. It's like, alright. I just remember forever ago, you're like, Like, all he eats is crackers and cheese. He needs to eat other stuff. I mean, yeah, I kind of Like, that's his snack stuff, but it's like, then they'll complain, oh, I'm on a diet for this, this, and this. I'm like, oh my god, fucking live. Like, just enjoy your last years, please. <laughs> Look, they're up there in age. <laughs> no, it did it again. Why? Yeah. Well, I think it's about time we start, considering, uh, we haven't seen the other two. I mean, Ingle? So. I mean, I could, but I'm lazy. <laughs> I can't really doing? argue with that. I'm back. What's going on? We're about oh, to start. I'm fighting with, uh, Roll20 D&D. D. Don't, don't mind me. I, I didn't need to be back, checks. I apologize, Faye. That. Oh my god. Well, this feels like this would be straight out of Durham. Why are you apologizing? I came back, you said, motherfucker. I was like, oh my bad. <laughs> <laughs> Not you. Not you. Ninja, I think you have an alien blaster, by the way. Looks a little bit too much uh, like alien tech. And now I'm concerned, which thing are we talking about? Uh, suspiciously gun, not gun. Oh, the thing in funny chat? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Why, is there other chats I'm not looking at? Uh, no, just we had a full on discussion about a uh, Star Wars blaster. Mm. Yep. It's, it's alright. Tabby isn't afraid of the darkness, luckily. He was born in the darkness, raised in the darkness. I, he was just that fast. You know, create undead just seems too complicated and annoying. Oh, to create one corpse, you need a clay pot filled with grave dirt, one clay pot filled with brackish water, and one 150 gold black onyx stones. 
So, what? What? In character, I want to go to the General Magic store and buy General Magic things. <laughs> no, I'm, so, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm not laughing at that. But <laughs> I, found, I found an image. Shit. Hey, Zach, I found the next upgrade for Mimics. Mm. <laughs> 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 oh my god, he's got the cat. Uh, <laughs> I recently oh, read no. a discussion. Oh no. They're Somebody talking about literally said, not... Give me a living chest with all my glizzies. Bro, can, can you imagine that? Can you imagine that mimic as well also be inside of another chest? So you open Shut the, the chest fuck up. The Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Don't give him ideas. There's so many oh, layers. God, just comes out of his tongue. <laughs> okay, look. Ninja. Yeah. I recently heard, read a discussion where they're talking about how technically mimics don't have a limit on how large they can be, and they're yeah. talking about how a whole plane was just a mimic. Like plane, as in like airplane or like realm. Dimension. All right. Yeah. And that it has buildings and people walking around. All of it, just the same mimic. See, this no, is where that did. that meme is, uh, like, is the building made of flesh, or, or is his flesh made of building? <laughs> uh, regardless, we're, uh, we're gonna start. Woo. Before I get too far off track. That never happens, what are you talking about? No. Uh, so last we left off, you guys were still, uh, just outside of Durham. What would Talk you like to, to do? Mm. Or a Whatever the fuck. These are the things that uh, I don't want to crack because they just get ship more fun cleaver. The time. There if we I go. If I remember correctly, uh, we just sent the terms to Framor. Mm -hmm. Were we waiting on that, or did we get that back? Did we did we get a message back or something? We can move out of the location now. Like, Ship Cleaver has confirmed that they'll offer aid to uh, Framemore, and Musa relayed that message back to Framemore. Awesome. Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> to Old Rain? Uh, yeah, but don't forget we have. To... Let's, let's grab our ship first. Well, obviously. Hopefully, uh. Our golden masked friend has uh, defended it so properly. Question, Ninja, just real quick: How fast does the our well tank move? Uh, faster than the carriage. So, like feet per second, and like feet. How much would you say, like in an actual character term? About uh, three wheels per second. <sighs> This is why I make busted shit. <laughs> and this is why I give you undefined terms. Fair enough. <laughs> There's a vicious cycle that has been started ever since I made Nagi. You're wondering how fast the vehicle goes? I yes. believe we can travel. If you're wondering how fast the vehicle goes, we can get in it and get it as full fast as possible. Find out. No. If I, if I were to gather an idea, the speed in which it took us to get from Framework to the Creek, if we went on foot, it would have taken us at least a week. It took us about three days, uh, well, not even three days, two days on our uh, machine. Alright. Either or. Let's get the fuck out of here. I don't feel comfortable. Oh man, I wonder why. Same. I get stabbed in the middle of the city. <laughs> not something you're used to, huh? Uh, I'm not used to that anywhere, or seeing that kind of behavior anywhere. Even if, mm. I know, like, we're a bit of assholes at Framor, but we don't just, nobody openly stabs people in the middle of the city. Well. You may anyway. see that Deep Smooth. That's very much a Deep Smooth type vibe, but not, not a Framor vibe. How insulting. We'll stab you in the back alley. 
<laughs> Without right. Listen, stab me to my face, not to my back. I but people didn't. like it from behind, right? <laughs> We're stopping this conversation. <laughs> That's just leaving. I love it. So you guys are able to get back out to the uh, the docks. How would you uh, like to proceed? Um, well, hopefully we can manage to grab ride. somebody and take us back to the, uh, the tank. Alright, how are you, uh, they gonna do that? Request as such? Man, only Ask people if there's a ship for hire, look for signs that look like, or like, ship for hire. Yeah. Alright, so give, give me a, uh, perception. Oh, I shit. will. Scroll, scroll, scroll. Unless Does the water has assist me? Yeah, sure. I'll, unless the water has lowered to levels that literally just uh, we aren't allowed to fucking. You get the picture. Yeah. Uh, um, you would find a low nugax who's uh, currently uh, polishing a spyglass uh, that has a sign that says they have a ship for hire. They probably haven't been hired because everyone. Oh, oh no! Wait, we're the ones that are weird, not him. <laughs> okay. I remember this place was racist, but I forgot it was racist for Nagiox and against everyone else for a moment. Zona. Not in the framework anymore. I know it's a little confusing. Um, would you be I mean, willing to kind of request it's... them to take us aboard, considering the fact that you're kind of the only one not looked down upon around here? For me. Getting back on our voyage. I'll pay you a hundred gold. Deal. Uh. I'll go up to the guy and ask how much to take us back to our ship. It depends where's your ship. Um, Tavi. Mr. Tavi's just gonna point in the general fucking direction of it. Listen, uh, we how have long... a map, right? Le he's gonna say it's on the other side of the well, continent, pretty much. Like, not the continent, but the other side of the ravine. Yes. Alright, it's ten gold. Easy. Okay. Per person? Smacks Vodak in the back of the fucking <laughs> head! <laughs> I don't know, he could just be talking with Sona. He might not you... be involved. She literally looked to us and asked us where it was. Let's, let's see how this goes. Alright. Oh my god. No, it's Tango. Oh, sick. I'm just gonna slam Tango down. Here you go. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's just like. Oh, really There's no table. <laughs> it's just. Fuck. Oh, I thought there was a table! I thought he was sitting at a table! He might be. That was just me playing out that situation in my head of you, like, literally using Mage Hand and clapping Ten Gold into it. Just so you could slam it down without throwing it into the dirt. I don't have Mage Hand. <laughs> How do you like Muddy Gold, bitch? What an arcanist. If, if there's not a table, I would hold it out right. for him. It will, uh... They will take the ten gold and uh, would uh, walk over to the uh, docks, and I will show you the ship they have. Uh, make sure I got the right one. <laughs> that. Damn. That's a cool ship. Damn. That's badass. Wait, that's a chariot. How are we going to fit in them? Oh, no, it's big enough for all of you. Oh, okay. The way it looks, it looks like it's a one-seater. Oh, so I know. I know. Use your imagination. Imagination. Okay. I'm just literally asking. <laughs> hey, don't ask questions. Just assume. That won't fuck you over. <laughs> Hasn't fucked us over yet. Oh, it definitely has. 
Yeah, look at Shale. <laughs> He's a puddle. I tr That's my fault, though. No, it absolutely wasn't. Uh, I take responsibility. I, I don't think you meant Shale, but all right. No, I meant Shale. He assumed he was a glitch and jumped off a cliff to test. But I put the idea in this head. Anyway, uh, you will be escorted to uh, to the other side of the uh, ravine to uh, to the wooded area where there is a small dock uh, on the southwestern uh, corner. All right, dope. And he will take All back right. off. Thank you. Well, not very talkative, but he does Got the, the fucking job done. Yeah. Which, okay. which side of the ravine are we on? Do you bring us over here or down to here? No, we're on here. The are sirens. Okay? I'm I'm always okay. So he yeah, says we're on... as blood pours out of his gut. <laughs> so yeah, we're down here, and so is our tank. I'll be DMing from the hospital. No. <laughs> so I think the thing our best, is I could see you do that. Yeah, so our best right. bet is to go through here and travel across the chasm and go up. Yeah. The only issue is the fact that unless we go by boat, there's no way we're getting into Aldrain unless we go through the tower. Well, I figure we go through the tower. Sounds good. I, I mean, the way you said it, is there a bad thing about going through the tower? I don't believe so. Just, well, like, yeah. the issue is the mountainous fucking terrain surrounding the entrance of the tower, all the way up here, we'd have to go through all of these mountains. I feel like the machine is built to handle mountainous terrain. Probably. I mean, it's, like, leggy. You can do it. All right. Well, actually, uh, Vodak. Yes. Would it be able to handle the mountains? Probably. I mean, it was made by folks who lived in the mountains, so... Should be able to handle mountains. In that case, let's go. All right. Wait, don't we need to get on the other side of the river first? We, that's why we're backtracking to the chasm. Okay. I miss onward. That. He, uh, well, you say onward. I feel like we should maybe look at the ship, see if it's even still there. I mean, it's a short walk back to your ship. Is it still? Uh, there? It'd be very obvious if it wasn't. I mean, yes, it's still there. There is also a pile of corpses around it, and you see Hestia on top. Oh, okay. hey, yeah. Holy oh. shit. Did you kill all those people? Start flying down straight towards Tatabi like a dart. <laughs> You're getting oh. tackled <laughs> for impact. You know what? Honestly, he's gonna take this as a fucking challenge. He's opening that fucking chest like a sumo wrestler. He doesn't want to get thrown back. <laughs> oh no! You'll get thrown back. <laughs> we will see, motherfucker. Strength ninja. Yeah, contest. All right. Do I roll for this? Yes. That's why it's contested. Probably strength. Probably strength. I'm not that strong. Neither am I. Strength times weight. If you're fat enough, you'll work it out. Are you calling Tatabi fat? No, I'm saying if Hissy is fat enough, she'll still knock down Tatabi. Well, I mean, she didn't, fat? but, you know. Yes, There Tatabi. we go. We now know that Tatabi, Tatabi is fat. has succeeded in the glomp. Ma'am, he braced and he rolled high. That's a, I was about to say he's strong. He is not. He yeah, has he not strong either? It's the Where magic. the hell have you been? Well, I got a dress. That answers nothing. Oh, can we see the dress? I also bought trees. Well, trees. Huh? Why yeah. do you buy trees? Because I wanted to. Who are all these people? Gestures to the corpses? Hmm? I don't know. Fair enough. Starts walking over to him. Muscle harvesting. <laughs> Rubbing his hands together. Sis. We have perverted science. 
listen. Do I want to turn my arms into whips? Yes. Do I want to make my legs into the fastest thing? Yes. Is this perverted? I don't think so. Yes. Why? <laughs> yes. All right. You know what? A if it's perverted... perversion of nature. Or something. Nah. Listen. Hey. You can, all, you can be as fast as you want, but you'll never be able to outrun your crippling depression. Ah, <laughs> oh, jeez. Don't be hitting us with that shit right now. Hey, Vodak, we, you want to do it again? Yes. Do you want to duel again? <laughs> Beating me up will not beat up the depression that you feel. <laughs> I feel like it would certainly help. It's okay. We're here for you. Kodak says, climbing into the ship. I am here for Tabi. That's sweet of you. Let me load these corpses into the ship. Oh. Okay. You can help if you want with the muscle alteration. Muscle alteration. Yeah, but she has muscles. <laughs> We're talking about Tabi here. He's not going to be cutting you open. He's going to be cutting himself open again. All right. It's not allowed. Who says? Me. But why? Mm, because I said so. How do you think I got the tail? You were fine with that. Wait, you... When did you get a tail? He... Tatabi... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I just realized... Perversion of nature. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Um, Tatabi has gills, a large scorpion tail, and his skin also looks stitched together. Oh, yeah. You know, you, you know, I, I, I never, I never accepted it. I, I just didn't say anything. It's all horrible. Is that a problem? Yes, you have a scorpion tail. It's cool, right? It is. It's completely cool. No. <laughs> Holds up hand for a high five from Tatami. I he wow. will uh, he will absolutely give you a high five. <laughs> <laughs> Unless I could ride the scorpion tail. Oh, by the way, uh, the Tatami, Tatami will show you the picture of that he drew of him before he died and went to hell, Hestia. It's in player pictures. I've seen it. Okay. <laughs> also, you, I don't think you answered her question. What is that? Uh, she asked if she's able to ride the tail. Um, I'll try. Okay. You must try it's now. not cool and then you want to have a ride from it? I mean, if I mean, if I could ride it, it'd be pretty cool. <laughs> now it's cool. It is a mount. Now it's cool. Now it's pretty all right. Uh, what did, when I saw that, light... I was like, wait, Tatami was a girl when I saw this. <laughs> um. So, would I be considering how light Hestia is? Would I be able to let her ride on the tail, Ninja? Sure. Why not? Hell yeah. Oh, yes. Now the tail is cool. <laughs> Anywho, I'm going to throw some of these bodies into the ship and hop aboard. All right. Why are we throwing them in the ship? I'm using them. Oh, okay. Just, uh, I don't know. Put them in a spot where they don't smell too much. Mm, can't guarantee anything. I know you can't guarantee anything. I'm just saying try to. Yep, How dare you touch all those bodies I killed without asking? May I? Yes. Thank you. <laughs> so shall we get on the road? <laughs> so anyways, I start driving. <laughs> so anyways, I started driving. Alright. Where would you like to drive to? Uh, we're gonna start making our way back to the cabin. Alright. Someone, uh... Be making uh, perception checks for our survival. I'm gonna be cutting arms off and attaching them to myself, so. I'll be up on the top doing the perception checks. Just let me know when I need to roll. 
So I'm gonna be watching Tatabi's process, but like at the same time looking away. I'll be with Rowan on the lookout. Yeah. Alright. Just let us know if like stone or like anything violently dangerous comes our way. Define violent. Giant gorilla. Anything that looks like it wants to attack us. Okay, got it. Like a giant gorilla. Like a giant gorilla. I don't think giant gorillas are real. Sounds pretty <coughs> big. I've seen one. I mean, to be See? fair, I've never They're seen a gorilla, real. so I don't know if gorillas are real. They're real. They are. Mm -hmm. Are you sure it wasn't just like a owl bear? Quite. No. The difference in gorillas and bears are very obvious. Uh huh. Next, you're gonna say that groundhogs are real. That's what I'm saying. Mm, those aren't real. Uh, you have been at sea most of the time. You have been in a city, both of you. No. <laughs> anyway, ninja. Yes. <laughs> Can I have six arms? No. no. <laughs> High five, Rona. I mean, yes, but they won't be able to do anything. They won't be able to do everything? Anything. They'll just hmm. hang around. Yeah. They'll give it you a hand plus, when necessary. Plus two, plus two to intimidation. <laughs> I mean, I would... I would like argue it's door. minus two. It's like... As you turn, they turn and flop around with you. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, I'll beat you! Blah, 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 blah. I Basically, mean, you got an arm poncho. I did wire nerves into a scorpion tail. I feel like with some um, proper prep time, I could manage to attach these things in a functional manner. I'm going to start let's, treating let's your brain like a, a battery. Here, as the healer who knows how to heal things, you only have so much space on your torso. And you need nerves and muscles to go between your torso and the arms for the arms to do anything. Holds you up a body, I have nerves and muscle. What we're saying. You see how much muscle just one set of arms need for each shoulder going across? I'm aware. You don't have enough space for that. At most, you would have enough space for four arms. I mean, hmm. All right. So if I alter my own torso to have another set of pectorals and shoulder blades, could I have four? We're gonna have to find out. You have to, <laughs> oper you have to operate on your spinal cord, but you could kill you. That is entirely true. I feel like that should weigh into the I'd fucking say process. Awesome. I mean, it is it is weighing into the process at the same time. I can, I literally can rewire parts of my fucking brain in this subclass without risk, so... Can I also chime in on this? Mm. As long as I'm right next to you when you're doing it, Tatami, and you've died within a minute, I can revive you. That is Only awesome. once. But I mean, the question comes down to should you. I mean, I think cool forearms would be kind of sweet, so yeah. I would. Right. But if he tries to do stupid shit like six arms, I feel like that's too much. It's not possible. I'll just let him back. Fair enough. All right, so I'll work on drawing up some schematics, per se, for a four-armed system. Sorry, I just... I, I picture something in my head. I just imagine Hesse waking up the morning just screaming, Hey, he tried to add more arms again. Can you res him again? <laughs> He's tried it once again. <laughs> well, I mean, Our literally, it has to be within the last minute. So by the time you'd be like, "Hey, he died again," it'd be too late. Yeah. Not if she hustled. Yeah, mm. like, I would have to be right next to Tabi and be like, "Ah, dead. damn it." Okay, Rez. All right. So I'm just so gonna have everybody who's keeping an eye out just give me a perception check. Should okay. I give medicine? Give me a moment. Sure. Nope. Perception. But yeah, Sweet. don't try that and like don't do the actual surgery itself until I'm around. Oh no, I'm just drawing up stuff. Okay. I just want to emphasize how dead you would be. Listen, I know. 
wait a minute. And I would Hobby. like to emphasize just how much this is going to stress your brain. Like, you want to just keep plugging things into an outlet. Eventually, you're going to hit that limit, buddy. I am aware. <laughs> However, the brain uses calories to do this shit. If I eat more, I should be okay. Okay, okay, okay. I just want to put out a thing. They've actually proven in studies that if you lose a leg and then you get a prosthetic, although that's still technically quote unquote the same leg in a sense, because you have to move your muscles differently to do it, you actually form new pathways in your brain to do that. So it takes a while for you to do it without feeling exhausted mentally. Yeah. So now imagine something you never had before, two extra arms. Here's the thing. You, I can still wire them like regular arms. The issue is the fact that there is now two of them. So I'm gonna have to kind of relearn the process of like, you know, fucking walking. And now I'm gonna have to deal with another it. two. That, that's... All right. Mm. Okay. Kind of, yeah, you're right. Cause you're having to learn how to not, okay, right now you can do both your hands at once. Like if you learn to juggle, you can juggle them, <laughs> but when you have four, you're suddenly like, oh, well, there's two extra things I have to learn. Like, you might accidentally knock one of your new hands and one of your old hands. You have yes. to get used to it again. Yes, that is true. Sorry, Sona, you're right. We're taking a long time for this. But Bobby... Sona, you would see mm. that uh, there is a uh, a caravan that is currently being held up about a mile and a half uh, up the road from you guys. I'm gonna tap Rowan and point. Oh, 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 well, that's not good. Hey guys, should we stop for this caravan? Why? I think we should. Because they'll be thankful and they'll mm -hmm. give a shit. What's wrong with it? It's being held up. Tommy jumps out of the top and starts running. Oh god. Oh, I guess I'll Someone grab too. him before he starts murdering. <laughs> so it's not that, it's not that great. It's a lunatic for murdering everyone. I am going to murder everyone. Somebody stop him, he needs more muscle. Because <laughs> <laughs> well, you're not wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I would follow a, a more safer pace of getting off the ship. <laughs> Alright. Hey, thing. I'm not really sure what the call is, to be honest. It, it's a ship. It's a ship. It's a land ship. Yes. Which is a tank. Yes. Anyway. So, yes, you can get down from uh, the top as well and prowl after Tabi's crazy antics that'll most likely get him killed someday. Probably. Yeah. But literally, he said, I don't want to be immortal. Why be immortal? There's a difference between, I don't want to be immortal and, hey, let me just run to death. Well, I don't intend to do either. I, I've i ran so fast that I have died. <laughs> Imagine. So, there are, uh, there are about, uh, four, uh, four humanoids, uh, currently holding up this, uh, this cart at, uh, Crossbow. Tommy come running up like, um, hey, question for y'all. Question right back, is this any of your business? Yep. What business do you have with this gentleman riding this car? Well, We're hoping that he'll sell some stuff to us. Ah, no, 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 Pro proceed, proceed, then he'll have more money that we can take. Go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> 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 so there are four. Mm -hmm. How decked out do they look? <laughs> like what? What is their equipment level? I should say. Uh, I mean, they've got some armor on them. Most of it's covered by rags. I'm gonna detect magic real quick. Do any of them have any magical items or anything of the sort? Like, are these yes. people? Yes. Mm -hmm. What am I seeing? Uh, chest pieces are magical to some degree. Nothing else? Nothing else that you can see. <clears throat> so, we can do business with the, um, caravan? Oh, yeah. 
Oh yeah, then then we'll wrap him afterwards. Sweet, sounds good. <laughs> Starts walking up to the caravan, like head, just like so. What are y'all selling? I just have raw materials. Oh, like what? Iron, lumber, some cloth. Right. At this point, I'm going to turn to the bandits that are holding up. Like, all they have are raw materials. What the fuck are you going to get out of it? It's got iron. I know what I'm going to do. Mm -hmm. I'm going to make a deal with the caravan. Oh, Lord. <laughs> I will save them if they join my empire. Only condition. <sighs> Buy elsewhere. What? What, what empire? What? Oh, hold up, something's wrong here. What, what? Are you guys heroes? No. Are we no. what? No. We're a group of travelers that sometimes stick our nose in the places that shouldn't be. I got executed. I crawled my fucking way out of hell. I'm certain. Just ignore him, he's oh, insane. God. I feel yeah. like they're leaving a terrible impression over there, Vodak says with his binoculars. Oh, you can absolutely <laughs> see it's not going well. <laughs> Uh, mm -hmm. so, so you're just not, not going to save me from these four? <laughs> no, we will. You just accept my offer first. What empire? Wait, why would I just agree to that? Is it because it's either that or get robbed. <laughs> I'm going to ask the bandits, like, what would it take for them to leave? We, we just want his iron and the gold that he has on him. Course. That's what it'll take for us to leave. But why? Why don't you just get a job? That's work. I mean, this is work. You're having to run around, you'll have to carry the iron. I mean, this is just a different way to work. Yeah, if you work easier. legally, then you wouldn't worry about having to get murdered randomly by a random group. No, I, I feel like I'd still have to worry about that. Not by us, at least. <laughs> and at that moment, I'm going to cast Sacred Flame at the one closest to me. Right. I'm darting! Hold Let's on. fucking kill some fuckers! Hold on, I'm, I'm asking Ninja something right now before we okay. start doing shit. Uh, <laughs> I'm asking Ninja a question. I mean, not by us, at least. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, is that a thing I can do, Ninja? Is that you think I'm capable of doing that? Yes. How far above do you want to aim? Enough where it's like, I want the, sh I want it to land 300 feet away from them. Enough to so where they see it blow up the ground. Give me an intelligence check. An intelligence check? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. So I mean, you could either aim it like just above them, or like at like about a good like eighty or seventy-five degree angle. Both would accomplish the same effect. I just fired. You know what? Just above them. All right. Let's let's see how this goes. Just run the D twenty. We'll we'll see how well this goes. Oh boy. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright. Love me, roll some damages. <laughs> I wasn't trying to hit anybody. Right. What do you mean, damage? That's fine. Uh, so... You think you've got the shot lined up. And you... You pull on the lever and, uh... Right as, uh, Rowan's going to cast Sacred Flame... Uh, all of you hear a loud boom, and just the sound of splintering wood from the back of a uh, oh, of the carriage, as you then see an explosion in the forest behind it. <laughs> like there is a nice like half moon shape that has been taken out of the back of this carriage, as the uh, the turret on uh, on Bodak's ship is uh, currently smoking. Nope. Well, I assume that offers what? up a good distraction. 
no, no, like all all five of the people here outside of you guys like turn to look at the ship just like what the fuck <laughs> in that time Vodak okay. would like to focus head out real quick to be like come on just leave just real quick ninja yes in the time that all these people are looking on the ship how many punches could i get off on this one motherfucker <laughs> Can I, I please do my spell? Yes, go, go and do your spell. I, I I rolled a thing. They have to do a dexterity oh, saving yeah. throw. Oh, I did I made I did the closest person to me. Oh, I was gonna summon a demon. They failed. Jesus, they're just bandits. I was just trying to scare them off. You all are like, mm, kill. Yes. Well, you see, I have a reason to murder things. Okay. Roll damage. I also no have a reason to murder things because. I want to help you get those arms. I think they'll be cool. You see, also, I also have a I, reason to murder things. I don't need the. I don't need these people for the arms. I have an entirely different reason that I need to murder these people. Well, I didn't know that. Anyway, also, also, I offered for them to leave, and they did. So it's kind of their fault. Yep. I too offered for them to leave. With a gun that oh, you okay. failed the to one aim. Closest to me that got oh no, hit that was intentional. Twenty damage. Yeah, he dead. Oh. Twenty radiant damage. Yeah, dead. And I'm gonna yell at the other three. That will be also you if you do not leave. Uh, Ninja, I have a question. I I know you do. <laughs> Considering the fact that that person died in 20 radiant damage and I can attack seven fucking times, would I just be able to straight up kill the the other three? I mean, sure, you can punch, you can punch a hole in his chest. Why not? Oh All right, excellent. I I DM'd you something as I do that to the other three. God damn it. Oh wait, I want one. God damn it. <laughs> Sorry. You know, I'm just so happy that for once my cantrip actually hit. Normally they get the save. And I have one. <laughs> gives a thumb and gives a thumbs up. I mean, you yeah. have the bodies. They are no the bodies. No, I think the bodies. You guys are murdering. I just love the imagine that we're actually doing this while the bandits were like, "What the fuck?" I'm they aren't regular play. people. They're bandits. Yep. I mean, people are classes. Listen, if I was able to have my arms staked and cut off and you then You don't know their lively situations. They didn't know mine. It's not like they fucking cared. <laughs> well, I mean, I offered them to leave. They didn't. Mar yes. Mar Today. Yeah. Because they didn't know they needed to be scared. And Vodak, you can't fucking talk to us. You're not here. You're on the ship. Three steps of the warlock. Shaking my head. <laughs> I'm shaking my head at this group. Hold on, I need to put something in notes. So, uh... The, uh... The cart driver might have some PTSD right now, but, you know, uh... He's, uh... Gonna he's alive! He's gonna casually just get the horse to get him move on. Wait, 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 no, I can mend his wait, wait, cart. It, no, 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 he didn't accept my deal. Don't mend his cart. <laughs> I'm mending his cart. <laughs> no, 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 he didn't accept my deal. He's not done here. Listen, we're not terrible people unless the people are terrible. I, I'm gonna go, wait, 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 sir, sir, I can fix your cart. You saved him oh, here? This is nothing but business. Does he stop, Ninja? Oh, hold on. Uh, I'm taking a look at Mending to make sure it can actually repair this guy to damage. Uh, it would take a while. I would only be able to fix, like, one foot. At a time. I mean, yeah, I'll... I'll give it to you. Yeah. It'll take a minute. Um... Here. Half a piece of jerky. <laughs> it helps with the shock. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna We're start fixing heroes. his cart. <laughs> You're a hero and... in the same way Deadpool's a hero. <laughs> <laughs> oh, also, you might want to just stare ahead. Uh, my friend's going to be messing with the bodies, and that can really mess up people's heads. I didn't intend to. Well, actually, hold on. Let me check my body. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> see? See? You uh, don't number one, see that, also, sure. you know what? I'm going to take these magical chest plates off of these people. Right. Can I identify them? Sure. They have enchantment magic on them. <laughs> what kind? Like, what do they do? Enchant. Uh, any special effects, like an extra AC, anything of the sort? I don't know, do you want to attune to them? Mm, no. Alright. 
So Cartman. Identify What's your name? All right, so. Huh. My name's Tim. <laughs> hey Tim, do you have family? <laughs> yeah. How, what are they like? I mean, they're good people. Don't hurt them. Oh no 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 no! I'm just I'm trying to help you calm down. I know all this is very very upsetting. Oh, by the way, lad, uh, Tim, if I remember correctly, he, like, plops down the, uh, chest plates in front of them. Those are magic. You can sell them for a decent price. Thanks. Oh, just Tommy, that's so nice. Are you okay? Do you have fever? Can I'm asking this to Tommy. Can I go Say now? again. <laughs> nope. Uh, am I done mending his cart? I mean, sure. Uh, yeah, the cart's fixed. Yeah, yeah! <laughs> People are never thankful anymore. <laughs> hey, do those bandits have any weapons? I mean, crossbows. Cool. Are any of them in good condition? They would all be in working condition. Uh, they would also have daggers on them. Ooh, nice. I'm going to take it back. I'm going to take those back to the ship. All right. Just, I did. How many, like, what, four daggers and four crossbows? Let me put this yes. in perspective. We just... Okay. I, we, we just killed, like, level two bandits. And once again, they had a chance to leave. That was their fault. I was yep. just trying to make them leave faster. It's the reason why I shot above them, not into the... Oh, but the Once reason why you shot the poor victim's cart? You, you shot the I was a little bit low, you. okay? I also, was a little low. Like, listen, I ha like, I'm trying to find bad people that I can fucking murder because I have plenty more that I need to kill. How many mu how much how many more muscles until you're just a bass of muscle? I am just a ball not of doing muscle. this for muscle. Was, I mean, technically, yes, and no. you need muscle to do what you want, so you're technically doing it for muscle. What, what's the Not muscle these. For? What, what, what are you killing for? Oh, I'm appeasing a lord that'll give me back my shadow powers. Oh, okay. Yeah. Starts walking off. Oh, that makes sense. All right, that does. That does. <laughs> Never mind. And remember, so Tommy, don't try to do the arms unless I'm around to revive you. I'm not gonna try and do the arms. I'm drawing up schematics. Hmm. Don't know if I trust that. Uh, I need to go. Uh, is there a sh is there shops in this place? I assume there is, yeah. Oh, I forgot the roll hills. You guys aren't in a town. I thought we were in Darium. We let, we've been out of Darium for a hot minute. <laughs> yeah, you, whatever. We're never even there. Okay, so I'm if you have the map free. open, uh, Tiny, we were here, then we went here, and now we're somewhere around here. <laughs> We're trying to get to here, and then go up to here. If this guy thinks I'm not about to buy a crystal ball, I am. He's fucked. Are you buying a crystal ball? Ball. ball. <laughs> to get Scrag. Ah, I guess that's the thing. Look, some people call it a peep show. Yeah. Hmm. You know... I've been. Th I just thought about this. Perhaps there's a bandit camp somewhere around here. I'm just saying. A lot of loot. Uh, can I use my survival list to try to see if I could see any footprints or trailing where they might have came from? Uh, sure. You know, I have to stay over here with no loot since I haven't been here. Hmm. Loot's on pretty okay oh, right well, now. I mean, you, you find a set of footprints and you, uh, you circle back on them to find it's Tatabi's footprints. Ah, oh, goddammit, it, Tatabi. What? You messed up all the footprints around here. I apologize. <laughs> he yeah, was walking. walking. Float. I can only do that for a minute. Well, we install wings on your back. Now you're in favor of this shit? No. He's oh, putting no, wings on my back favorite. first. I was just giving you an idea. 
Why would you ever do that? Plus, why fly when I can run faster than everything that can fly? Allows you to get up walls faster. Mmm, depends on whether or not I can climb like a spider. I don't see any spider slippers on you. You don't need to. So, Tommy, give me a investigation check. Alright. Just a second. Awesome. By the way, Ninja. Yes. Don't don't worry. What I said was just a business deal. I am just a business person trying to do business. Yeah, I'm well. sure. I'm absolutely <laughs> sure. Thank you. Glad you understand. Tatabi, you uh, you would find a letter on uh, one of the bandits. All right. It looks old. What's it say? Oh god, is it gonna be like from his kid or something? Yep, uh, it absolutely is. It is uh it is currently sealed, like with a uh, wax stamp. I'll open it up. Well Where? actually hold on. Mm. Is it magic? Uh would you like to do detect magic again? Yes, please. Uh yes. Yes it is. Mm. Just the stamp or the entire letter? Uh the entire letter. Uh, can I identify this as well? Uh, this would be conjuration magic. Ooh. Tempted. I doesn't got identify, you. Doesn't identify tell you the effects of it. Not in this campaign, I don't. Not in this campaign. Oh, uh, okay. The rules. I'll just open it for free. I got you. All right. Um, Yay. I have this thing. I'm not sure I want to let somebody open it. I view Hestia as a child, like, jumping up, trying to reach this letter as the Dobby's holding out. No, why do you think she is? Like... Like, I want to read it out of here! No! Down! No! Could be, could be magical! No! Down! Watches <laughs> his tail. She starts climbing around his tail to climb up. D whip's tail. <laughs> no! Give it! Uh, Give it! No. Give. No. Why not? No. Because you might set up a spell like for the rest of us. Exactly. I'm willing to take that risk. Give. No, I'm not. Oh. Uh, I'll keep this pocketed for the moment. And I'm paying very close attention to fucking Hestia in case she tries to steal it. Hey, right. Shut the fuck up. I wasn't going to do that. How dare you take the idea I was going to do. <laughs> How dare you read my mind. That's my job. <laughs> hey. My 10th level ability specifically says you can't read my mind. How dare you. You know... This is exactly how I feel like that would go. My ability says you can't read my mind, Hestia. We know you. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh, yeah, that's... I guess that's how that works. <laughs> Tell me how the grass tastes, little man. <laughs> the fuck up. So, what would you guys like to do now? Go to Disneyland. We are going to Disneyland, except it's not Disneyland, and it's farther north. I mean, actually, uh, hold on. A pale Lich Starty would be really good in terms of helping me out with this. You know, the old arm thing. Yeah, let's go. Back on track to the castle. Alright. You guys are all piling back in? Yeah. So, and if that's true, I would recommend watching uh, the video I put in funny, funny chat a little while ago. <laughs> Will do. It's called Stable Diffusion. I was wondering why you were so quiet. I'm just, I'm just 
here. I exist. Could you send me a DM on where there are temples for my goddess? Uh, I need it for a spell. Sure. To top it, give me a perception check. Alright. Sorry, I was just looking for like a slightly empty spot of tape to say that. Tavi, uh, Hestia is going through your pockets. I'm just gonna grab her by the wrists. <laughs> Lift uh, her up. <laughs> oh, I'm just looking at your new body parts. Oh, Does she have the letter? Uh, it's currently in her grasp, yeah. Yes. <laughs> but the letter. Can I just take it out of her hands? Alright. Probably, yeah. Thank you. She wouldn't fight that much. <laughs> Hey guys, when we go to the chasm, can we stop off for a moment? I need to do something real quick there before we go through. That's fine, mummy. Okay. Why do I feel like I'm missing something? I'm literally just audibly here to top and go, ooh. What? Why? He's you gonna just... walk over, give the letter to Sona. Uh, oh. Oh. Just don't mess with it, please. Nope. Alright. You're gonna trust Sona with that one? Shrugs. <sighs> okay, sure. So, do you want to look at the letter at all? No, I'm gonna use the. What, what was it? Is it? Hold on. Your lockpick? Yeah, no. Is it that what it's called? Probably. The, the pick and pocket. Yep. Yeah. Much appreciated, by the way. Mm -hmm. Oh, Vodak? Yes. Can I have my 100 gold now? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's over the 100 gold. Thank you. I thought I already gave it to you, I apologize. Oh, Alright, hop back in the cabin. Alright. Now, with the medicine, did I make, like, a decent basic sketch for how these muscles would work for the forearms? Yeah, it doesn't look great as you're... You got a lot of stuff in the way, but, you know... Well, yeah, but there's already a bunch of, like, subdermal muscles and everything. I'm pretty sure I'd, m like, be able to figure some stuff out anyway. I mean, it might work, might not. Might, might not. Honestly, that's the way most things go in D&D, &D, so that the fact the that there's... your book. <laughs> might work, might not! <laughs> Anywho, I'll continue drawing up that, and I'll also, like, once I get a decent basis on that, I'm probably going to wait until we get to Uldrain to actually have any of this implemented due to the fact that there are pails there that can help. But I'm also going to work on some sketches for, uh, you know, turning the arms into whip, like removing the actual bones and having most of it controlled by muscles, so there's no joints or shit. For which thing? Uh, the whip arms. Alright. Which I actually drew a sketch of by myself, outside of character, because oh, I thought it was fun. Of course. <laughs> of course. 
I have whip arm. You're about to get whiplash. Yes. I mean, you want to see? I think it's cool. Granted, I like muscles. Sure. All right. Let me get. We can continue on, by the way. I thought the shit was continuing moving this whole time. Yeah. yeah we've been writing. I mean, hey. I mean, in terms of uh, the Story. game and everything, just yeah. Uh, what you didn't know is that the story was going on all around you, just like life. As always. Uh. You would, uh, be hitting your nighttime here at this point. Alrighty. What are uh, you guys going to do? I will get ready for sleep, but first, I will put out the Guardian. Alright. And I will sleep on the top deck. Wait, does the weather look like it's gonna be good? Clear. No seeping storms coming around. Uh, looks like it's gonna be fine for now. Yeah. Okay. I'll sleep outside. Up right. on the top. At the crow's nest, right? Just up top? No, no, no. Just on the top of the ship, not the crow's nest. I want to no be able to stretch nest. out this as much as I want. Wait, there is no crow's nest? There's no crow's nest. We need a new ship. Then I definitely am so, not the crow's nest. This one's nest. broken. Do, do you even know what the ship looks like? Not. I mean, I looked at the images for it. So I do know what it looks like, yes. <laughs> but it doesn't change my opinion. <laughs> this fucking looks like. I haven't seen what the ship looks like, except I've seen what the ship looks like. Ah, yes. I'm gonna go up to Vodak and tell him the ship's broken. God. Vodak, how do you respond? How do I respond? That's a good question I don't really have an answer to. <laughs> I mean, I can't really, really feel that. I thought you would just ask how it's broken. <laughs> like, I don't know what else you would say. The longer this pauses, the more just, like, stoned out of his mind, just looking at it. And like, you know? <laughs> yeah. I just imagine that Vodak's just staring at Hestia. Like, yeah, and Hestia's just sure. staring at Vodak. No, no, you, it's the thousand yard stare pass. Like, <laughs> Yeah. He and they're just me. nothing. He just but I look at him. Goes back to what are you doing? Oh, the ship's broken. Ship can't. The ship's not broken. How would you there's, break a ship? How would you break no, a ship? There's no nest. That's all. All ships. Go to your there. room. <laughs> what room? Just Boy, join me. Yes, with the pile of corpses. This isn't that kind of ship. This is a... Okay. It is a ship with piles of corpses. I know you're going to say warship, and that is not the wrong definition for that. Not any kind what? of... It's like a... It's like a big beetle with a cannon on it. Where do I sleep, then? There's Bobby, like, tell me. In one like of the rooms, rooms that is on this thing. No. I mean, sleep on the top of the ship like I'm doing. I don't know what to Dad. copy, tell me. There are rooms down here. Uh, you fucking in one of the rooms, or I don't care, you could sleep on the bodies. Be his I'll dummy, sleep on the bodies. Say again. Uh, 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 uh. Hold, uh, hold up, hold, hold, hold up. <laughs> Let's shut the fuck up. <laughs> just... <laughs> I, I have never heard someone say something for me to instantly just think, <laughs> shut the fuck up. <laughs> like, normally I'd say that as a joke, but that is that was kind of genuine. I'm not even gonna... <laughs> Alright, hey, first of all, is somebody gonna be taking watch or are you guys just gonna park for the night? 
Nah, who needs a watch? I'll go... Estia, don't you have a fucking eye that can do things for you while you're asleep? Yeah, she does, but she doesn't care. I'll you're drive to... until <laughs> it's... Until... Bodak will drive until he thinks it's third watch, and then he'll go to bed. You will wake up exhausted, man. No, 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 no. Wake up Rowan at second watch. Okay, I'll wake up Rowan at second watch. Thank you. I was gonna say, if you wanted to tell something to Hestia, she would probably listen, but if not, then she'd probably just go and sleep in Tommy's room and, like, a random something. Yeah, fair enough. I can take third if you need. I, I'm gonna be taking second and third. I, I only need four hours of sleep. Oh, perfect. Flops. And also, I have a fucking eight-hour guardian, so... Yeah, fair enough. Alright, so Vodak, you're gonna go till, uh, till, uh, second shift? Yeah, I'm gonna go till second shift, he said I'm gonna wake up Rowan. Alright, uh, give me a person check. A person per check? image? Yeah, whatever it is. Cinnamon. Alright, I'm giving a person check right now. Yeah, give me a person check. You know, any people? It turns out I am me. a person. Oh, that's badass! It turns out I am one person. Alright, how many people do I oh. see? I mean, there's enough people. Alright, that's good, that's good. <laughs> uh, I mean, you would see, uh, <laughs> four others. Let me know! Yes. You know, go for to Tatabi. I, I don't see Horu or, uh... Nope. Sophie? I mean, that's the... the fucking, uh... Musa. Musa. What? How'd you get so many out of music? I don't know. My brain just fucking, you know, me. Just, <laughs> you know, just fucking, you know, me. <laughs> That's... You know the, you know when someone dies in a hospital and the machine goes, Bee! you know, that's what happened in my brain. <laughs> <laughs> so you've been mentally flatlined. Yeah, mentally flatlined. <laughs> the mental flatline. Uh, I will tell you what you see in the private chat. Okay. Oh, private. You know, it's the spicy Ooh. things when it's in private chat. You see a spider. I hope I don't see a spider. That's <laughs> it. He said, I just imagine him going up, look out, just a spider comes down from the ceiling. Hey, hey. An entirely <laughs> regular sized spider. Yep, like exactly. It's a regular sized spider. It's like, hey, well, what the fuck? No. <laughs> Literally, Sona sees a spider. This is worse than a dragon. It is. I'd rather fight a dragon than a spider. I would, I would probably summon a greater demon just to kill the spider. Look, I'm just saying objectively, I'd rather fight a uh, giant spider than a uh, regular sized spider. <laughs> Why? <laughs> because it's well, easier to hit, and you know where it is. What kind? What, what, what kind is a regular size spider? Cause you got jumping spiders, wolf spiders, tarantulas. All of them are spiders. objectively the worst. I'm saying if like we're talking giant, like as a D and D giant spider, I'd much rather fight something like that. I like jumping spiders. They're cute. That was a I'd giant. Be, can you imagine a giant jumping spider though? That'd be adorable. Just the ground shaking. No, no, no. Say that's adorable. What would be but, like jumping spiders are like apex predators. Yeah, I would ride it. No, what would be even more terrifying is that you're just chilling and then you just see this giant shadow go over you. <laughs> like, oh hell no. Nah. Listen, even even my girlfriend agrees, riding a giant spider sounds awesome. You have to tame it first. You can't just First of all, your tame. girlfriend's weird. <laughs> that was a weird noise. I'm sorry, I She's dating Zach. Yes. What the fuck do you expect? <laughs> Exactly as stated. <laughs> Thank you. If I didn't weird. have to worry about the giant spider eating me, I would definitely want to ride it. She said that was a great compliment. Thank you. Oh, you poor soul. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Poor, poor, poor soul. Is it second watch yet? Almost. What? I'm a 
Alex gonna look around to float in another uh, round to the cannon. That's a very big oddball chunk as it uh, sits in a place and you push the door closed. I, I figure I could do that by myself. I feel like it's definitely like for a regular sized human, a two man job. I feel like Vodak's big and strong enough to do so, it by himself. So it's not the fact that it's a two man job in that sense. It's a two man job in that there's usually somebody who sits in here and would uh, load the rounds as you pilot and aim. Yeah. Or you could leave the aiming up to. How, uh, how big is this glowing object? Uh, you have no idea exactly how far it is. It's to the north, which is kind of the direction, like, on the map. Where are we here? Like, where are we sitting on the map? I think we're like right here, or here. Oh, somewhere right there. Right, right, Why right, is right, there right. a little fucking smiley face? Well, Why can't, not? Can't, can't you just be happy for once? <laughs> no. Part of the north, I assume. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you we move say part of the north, I assume it's up here in this mountain range. No, it, it's much farther north. Like, up here? Yeah, somewhere up in that region. <laughs> That's mildly concerning. Uh, I'll just make a mental note of that. Go wake up, uh, Rowan. Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Ah, uh, we have bacon? No. Oh. Uh, <laughs> we have no bacon. Rude. But, uh, it is your turn to, uh, to work with this shit. Uh, anyway. Alright, just imagine there's no bacon and just Rowan going to bed. Like, back to bed right in front of my <laughs> <laughs> No, 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 I'm up. Just had the rose of bacon. Maybe I'll get some when we get to the city. I guess wake up whoever you feel is the most responsible for the third shift. No, I have third shift. You're doing first, second and third? Yeah, I don't need much sleep. I only need four hours of sleep. Oh, okay. I'll get some sleep. All right. Rowan, roll me perception check. You said roll perception? Yes. Okay. Sorry, my cats are meowing. Do it being food time. You have cats? I have two cats. Oh, <laughs> I <wanna see> <laughs> <laughs> Just so you know, I rolled it. Oh, I did see. Give me a second. Okay. I just wanted to check. You. I sent you a picture of my cat, Sona. You did? You did? I love the watermark. I just have that automatically. I'm worried about how much is being typed right now. Yeah, don't worry about it. I will. It's just natural for me to be worried.
Is that because I got a 20? Yep. Um, uh, <laughs> can I roll something to try to see if I understand what I'm speaking? Yeah, give me a religion check. Jesus. All right, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'll answer that. No problem. Hey, you know these throwaway rolls you're doing? Yeah. Here, have some nat 20s. Don't worry, when you get in combat, you're gonna get nat ones. <laughs> That's always how it is for me. Oh, combat? Nat ones. That's the only nats you'll be getting. Question. Yes. Because I've seen them, am I now familiar with them? In what sense? And then I can use sending. Uh, yeah. I mean, are you uh, going to try to? I don't know. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm very tempted to, but I don't know. Yeah, do whatever makes you feel right. I just also don't want to die. <laughs> <laughs> what, what makes you think that would happen? <laughs> they look big and powerful, and from myth, they seem to be big and powerful. Just because they're thought to be peaceful doesn't mean that they won't be like, ah, oh, you're annoying me. Stop. <laughs> uh... You know what? <laughs> I'm gonna message them and be like, hello, do you happen to know a way to stop Stone? <laughs> the creature named Stone. <laughs> Oh lord, help me. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, elsewhere, help me. Hey guys, we die, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sure it wasn't directly your fault. No, it wasn't. Oh god. It absolutely was. <laughs> this is gonna be bad. Yeah, boy. Alright. Oh wait, that wasn't a saving throw. Here, go ahead and re-roll it. Alright. How brain dead will I be when it talks back? Haha. -ha. <laughs> 
That's always something lovely to hear your party member saying. Eh, technically you're asleep, so you don't hear me saying this. I'm talking out of character. Oh, okay. Yeah, but I do. Oh, right. <laughs> I mean, if you're downstairs, you don't. I mean, I guess it depends how loud you are, I guess. Also, I probably wouldn't say it out loud. It's so, see. But yeah. Yeah. I'm just gonna give a thumbs up in the direction of them. <laughs> All right. And clean like, off the nose. Yeah, it's, it's like you, you do that, and then it's like the head comes. Out, I was like, oh god, I'm bleeding. <laughs> but you also feel like you have lost an hour, as you are definitely not in the same spot as when you started sending. What a trip. Uh, but uh, I'm confused. Oh, but at this Don't point, worry, I'll tell you when everyone wakes up. Alright. <laughs> Tommy's never gonna believe it. Uh, at this point, uh, the sun would start to creep up, and that's when you would lose uh, a sight of the uh, northern lights. Oh, let me see oh. here. Um, okay, so it would be long enough that everyone's had a full rest now? Yes. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna use Thaumaturgy. Oh, this can't go well in a confined metal ship. I mean, she's on the outside unless she goes inside. She's driving. Leave... Oh. I'm not driving. Am I driving? You were. No one told me I was driving. Mm -hmm. But, okay. That's what I assumed you were doing. I just assumed I was taking... Mm -hmm. But, yes. Um... So then, in my wait, driving's inside the ship. How would I have seen them? Oh, there, right. there's a window through the uh, out the um, front. Um, and also, okay. Like, anyway, yeah, I'm gonna use thaumaturgy well, and yell out, "Everyone, wake the fuck up!" Oh, I wanted to do something. I wanted to do something before the night ended. Besides sleep. <laughs> yeah, I wanted to cast a dream onto Tommy. Oh my god. <laughs> Because, because I can. So, Only how, how sexual is this dream getting? God. None. Bullshit. <laughs> no, I don't. I'm not playing a sexual character. Fuck you. Yeah, but I also know your intentions, so I would like to reiterate. How sexual is this dream getting? Oh, no, I'm kidding. Uh, it's, it's not. Alright. I was, I was just gonna wish him a good night's sleep. Sweet dreams inside of his dreams. Oh god. You, you know what? So now Tatabi wakes up oh, 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 oh. to. I can make this a little more fucked up, too. Uh huh. Oh, god. Because you can manipulate Tatabi's dreams, you can literally just be a random person in the middle of Tatabi's dreams and just be like, sweet dreams, Tatabi, and then just fade into the mist. Yes. Yes, that's what I want to do. Oh, I just want to pop in and say that and then leave. Why? Why? You won't know that she did that. Yeah, you have no I, idea. I know, but, yeah. like, why? <laughs> I like that that's what gets you the why, and not... I want I want centipedes for arms. That has, like, a reasonable, like... No, it fucking doesn't. <laughs> Don't put reasonable centipede arms in the same sentence ever again. <laughs> I fucking will. Watch me. No, no, it's reasonable, guys, but using Dream to wish me goodnight? Ah, 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 unheard of! <laughs> oh, God. Uh, anyway. Anyway, you're all awake. To talk, yeah. you feel like something was the wrong about yelling. your dreams. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm fucking aware. <laughs> like, um... it, it's just the subtle, like, have I been thinking about Hestia more since she got back? What's, what's going on here? Morning. Right, let's go out. It gets up. Just, I just went to sleep. I just fell asleep. This is some shit. You've been asleep. You should try sleeping better. It's morning. Ooh. Did not feel like it. The best way to get sleep is to sleep. 
Anyway, God, guys. God, a fucking wisdom. Important shit. Okay. Yes. So. You've heard of those dudes. <laughs> that. What are they called? Oh, Watchers of the World. No. Right? Have, have you heard of those dudes? Sure. Important shit. You've heard of those dudes. Oh my god. To be clear, first of all, that is not a very common thing. It is a, uh, it's a very obscure religious fact. Yeah, literally whenever you asked that to Tommy, just went, no. I mean, couldn't they just roll to see if they know what I'm talking about? I mean, they can. And will they? Probably not. But if anybody wants to take a crack at it, go for it. Sure, why not? <laughs> Might as well. Uh, religious? I appreciate you, Tommy. Religion. Alright. No. No. Okay, so there's no. these ancient mythical creatures right. that are considered to be the watchers of the world. They're thought to be the wants to be the source of all resources that were ever granted to the world, okay? The thing is, is that they've basically almost faded completely from knowledge. And I saw one last night. Are you sure? Yes, that's why I have a bloody nose. And you see the, or you can see where it kind of wiped away, but not completely cleaned off. I asked oh. if they knew how to uh, defeat stone, and they talked back, and I kind of lost an hour, and then all I heard was, we will watch. All right. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm going to put what they look like in FOC chat. That's horrifying. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It talked to me and made my brain hurt. Okay. Um, I'm gonna. I think it was trying to say as little as possible so it wouldn't kill me by just talking to me. I'm gonna be entirely honest with you. This concerns me more than anything. It looks like a dinosaur. Why? You know what's I weird is that you can like actually say that and it's correct in the debate. I don't like being watched, I don't think. Hey, it's not like they're gonna care if you're masturbating to hobby. You'll be fine. Okay. The one cardinal sin that made us say no, the world can't be saved was the Tabby masturbating. <laughs> <laughs> I saw oh god, I just had a really room. horrible thought. <laughs> As someone who slept next to him multiple times, I don't think he's done that. Uh, he, he, he's a one-shot Johnson. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> when he rolls over in, in the middle of the night, that's all it takes. <laughs> Look, I, I just want to say, this is, like, payback shit for, like, you asking about where you're going to shit in a fucking jail cell, Rowan. <laughs> But I find it funny, so is it really payback? Yes. That makes no sense. Yep. It, it, it will be payback once you no longer find it funny. Yes. <laughs> okay. So, uh... Alright. You know, if it comes down to it, maybe they'll intervene to make sure stone doesn't destroy everything? Who knows? Mm. I'm just saying, it was really cool. Also kind of terrifying, but cool. I would fucking assume so. That kind of looks... Yes, like, no, I, I, I would prefer not to see one of those. Understand, this isn't the picture that you see in real life. She would have, like, tried to draw it out. Do I need to do a performance to draw it? I mean, if you want it to be good, sure. I mean, like, this is gonna... you'll still my get... opinion is the same. You'll still get the same general feel, because you can add, like, mountains to the bottom to show scale and shit like that, but... Yeah. How well you do it is... I mean, ah! it's not bad. It looks pretty good. Nice. I will be right back, though. Okay. 
you know, I have to admit, even if nothing else crazy happens this session, that was cool. <laughs> hey, you saw a mystical creature. But seriously, I rolled nat 20 twice. So, <laughs> so did you just leave for 20. a bit? Yeah, he said he would be back in a minute. You know, I want to say something. Oh, he Shoot. said absolutely nothing about Hestia standing out a pile of dead corpses, by the way. He said nothing about that to me. <laughs> it's typical ninja fashion. Of course. Yeah, he, honestly. He tosses you in there. It makes it fun. He does, and I just go, hey, you know what? Okay. And here you are. Meanwhile, the person who's coming in, like, what? 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 Oh, I'm on stage? Oh, okay. <laughs> Hello. I feel like if Ninja was one of the, uh, like, show curators, he'd just drop some motherfucker on the stage and be like, it's your turn. And he'd be like, I had a plan, but there's nothing here that incorporates my plan. And also, I didn't know I was coming on. And Ninja would just be like, shut up, go. Otherwise, you're fired. Uh, <laughs> shut up, go. That's what I said. And I said you're on stage, so that means you're on stage. <laughs> Do you have complaints? I don't care. <laughs> I'd like to reiterate that you probably still wouldn't have asked questions about it anyways. You, no. you know, you're right. <laughs> I just expedited the process. You're absolutely right. I probably wouldn't have. I probably would have just been like, eh, okay. So. What would you guys like to do? Uh, can... Uh, well, I would like to take a break from steering the ship. I'll go Fair. back to driving. I can just hear this shit. But I get back into the driver's seat. Uh, also, uh, how much longer would you say we are from the castle? From the castle? A few hours, maybe. Nice. That's a maybe, a hard maybe. <laughs> I'm just gonna trust you on that. I don't think that you would lie to me. <laughs> so, uh, it would actually take just a few hours before you guys would see the chasm again. Nice. What are, are your plans in the chasm? Uh, I just need to stop real quick to go to the temple. I need to do something with my goddess report. Alright. Um, you know, clear things. Scrub. Scrub, I don't go to a temple for that. I just say hello to my goddess whenever. Oh, like, she's good. She was the ship till everyone's done with what they need to do. I'm I mean, just gonna yeah. chill in there, work with corpses. I'm actually gonna try and... Ninja, if this is alright, I'm gonna try and use one of the dead bodies to practice making the muscles into what I'm looking to do. Alright. Uh, give so me wait, are a... we at the stage? Oh, I know what Yeah, you'd be Sorry. at the chasm. Katavi, give me a, uh, a perception check. Uh, perception? Rowan, give me a religion, yes. Okay. Oh, I was just gonna ask the guard at the gate where the temple was. You'll see why. <laughs> oh. Oh, I, I know what I'm gonna do, Ninja. Scroll, scroll, scroll. And that is? I'm going to explore it. And then use my eyeball to, to look for the most valuable <laughs> item. Bless you. On the body, or...? Mm -hmm. it, it's, it's just, like, the most valuable thing within, like, a certain meter radius. Alright, yeah, where are you investigating? Uh, inside of the, of the, of the chambers. The whatever. Alright. Uh, I will get to that in just a second. Uh... Rowan, uh, you get ready to ask the guard, but you feel the natural pull of, uh, of your, uh, your goddess, and you are able to locate your temple fairly quickly. Oh, thanks. Think of it like a gentle, like, tug on a rope, like, pulling in the direction that the temple is. But, uh, nice. Tatabi, mm -hmm. uh, you are, uh, here, moving the bodies. Uh, you see the letter again, sitting on uh, on top of one of the corpses. I see the what? The letter that you had uh, Sona seal away. Okay. 
Just fucking glares at it. Should it just let me open it? I'll just open it. Fuck it. <laughs> uh, it's not gonna go away, I know that much. What else? Is there like... Oh, I'm guessing because it's a nature temple, there's probably like an outside area. Yes. Okay. I'm gonna look for one that looks like no one really bothers to go in it too much, and I'm gonna set up a word of recall there. Alright. After doing that, I'm gonna go in and ask if I can help in any way at the temple. Real quick. Where's green? Oh, sure. Not working. Give me a uh, perception check. I don't uh, you would uh, see that there's a group of uh, clerics trying to hoist a uh, ship from. Uh, uh, the, uh, one of the ledges down below. And they could use any hands possible. I'm going for Alright. Oh. <laughs> well, I mean... <laughs> uh, oh, fuck. Like, at least let me pay for dinner. Roar, give, just give me a strength check. Thank you. I kept trying to hover the mouse over strength, and it was like, no, 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 we're not going to give you a clickable thing, and it's like, for fuck's sake. Uh, so you are able to hoist the, uh, the boat, uh, up to its, uh, previous level, and they do, like, anchor it in place so that it can't slip back down. But you would still be able to see that there is a, uh, the water has not come back yet. Ah. Hey. That sucks. Uh, real quick, Ninja. Yeah? Is there an ability to reply in this? Nope. Uh. Alright, well. Just gonna say. You've caught my interest with the offer. Um. Is there a method of communication? Uh, by the way, uh, uh, Vodak and Sona and Hesse, you'd all be able to hear Katabi start talking to her himself. Should we, um, check on him, or do we just, um, not do that? I mean, I'm sure he's fine. <laughs> it's oh. Just a little, uh, a little weird. Don't really hear people talking to themselves like that. A whole lot. Last I mean... time I heard someone talking to themselves like that was a, um, Oru. I mean, does he look crazy? Not yet, but did Hora look crazy when she first talked to herself? Yeah. And he is trying to attach four arms, does that, does that sound a little uh, crazy? 
little luck. Maybe he's just ambitious. How are you doing, Donna? Um, I'm fine. Why? I don't know. Make a small talk. Mm hmm. How about you? You should work on it. You know, it's not, it's not much fun to it. Yeah, yeah, I can tell. Thanks for the brutal honesty. Yeah, anytime. <laughs> uh, Rowan, at this point, you would be done. Uh, I said the question. Oh, it wasn't crazy important. It'll just decide what I'm going to do next. But, yeah. yeah. Tiny. <laughs> uh, would I be able to find the group? Yeah, you'd be able to find that giant monstrosity, uh, tank that's sitting uh, outside for right now. Hey, does anyone in the group have like 200 gold I can borrow? Yeah, sure. Okay. I just want to go ahead and get some stuff I need just in case if I need to revive someone. Got it. I'll give Rowan 200 gold. Thank you. I'll mark down that I owe you 200 gold. <laughs> it's okay. Oh, it's okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, also, Sona, would you happen mm -hmm. to know if there's a jeweler in the city? Um, no, but I can help you look. That would be greatly thankful. I, I'd be thankful. God damn, I can't talk to <laughs> <laughs> That would be greatly thankful. Yes. Oh my gosh. I'd be very thankful. <laughs> yeah, sure. Uh, what do we need to roll? Uh, investigation. I will assist you, Sona. Okay. I'm not good at investigating things. I mean, I can't speak well either, so it's not surprising. I mean, I'm not that smart either, so we'll see how it goes. Yeah. Oh. Two dumb people running around in circles. <laughs> Fuck roll, yeah. Roll once more. There you go. Okay. Uh, you guys would be able to find a, a jeweler shop that is open. It's a gnome that looks up at you. What can I do for you? Hi, I was wondering if you had any diamonds for sale? Oh, yeah, what, uh, what kind of, uh, size are we looking for? Uh, what size would I need ninja for revive by? I know it needs to be 300 gold pieces. I mean, then whatever 300 gold pieces are. Speaking of which, small side rant here. I always find that funny, like, no matter what kind of society it is, it's like, it doesn't matter the size of the, uh, the gem, it's the value of the gem. Yeah, yes. I, I think that's kind of bullshit too. What a retarded way to do it, but hell do I love it, it just makes things funny. <laughs> The economy's gone to shit. Diamonds are worth three billion. Ah, cool. So I just need a fraction of what I had to revive you. Cool. Exactly. <laughs> well, the way I translate it is the quality of the gem. The more gem costs, the higher quality it is. It's probably what they meant by it, but it's uh, not the best way to do it. Yeah. yeah. It's just always. Like, it'd be to better make. to say you need you, know, you need a high quality gem. Yeah, like if if, if you stated a high quality gem worth at least this i would be like, all right so like yeah. they're indicating that's what it's referring to no it's just a gem of this worth this type a diamond worth 300 all pieces it's like uh, okay uh i guess a medium diamond question mark yeah all right he uh he pulls out a uh a case of them 
Uh, they're all individually, uh, like, capped uh, in, like, glass containers. Uh, you see one that uh, suits what you need, or...? <laughs> Do they have prices under them? They would, yeah. <laughs> what are the prices? Like, I already have some 300 gold. Uh, you would spot mm -hmm. a few that are at least 300. Uh, there are a uh, few that are, like, 500 and one that's 1,000. Oh, jeez. I don't know. I don't have that much money to be on me. Uh, oh, that one right there that's around 300. That, that looks good. Alright, yeah, the, the price is listed. Are you interested in uh, purchasing that today? Yes. <laughs> and I'll just slide over the 300 gold. Alright, I'll hand over the... Uh... Which is kind of funny to think about, because, I mean, I'm sliding over 300 coins. Yeah. I always thought it's weird, but I, I don't question it at this point. Yeah, there's just some things it's better not to question. Like, I'm gonna be real, part of me wants to do the, the ninja thing and just, like, create a bullshit situation, situational fix for that shit. Like, uh, somebody wished for, like, coin punches to hold infinite coins. Like, some bullshit like that. But, like, another part of me is, like, Video game logic. Co coins don't matter. It's fine. Yeah. Yeah. I remember I was reading a book one time, and they had it to where you could see on your coin bag how much money was in there, and you could tap with the tags on it to just transfer money as much as you want. Yeah. And I was like, oh, that's kind of cool, but kind of lazy, too. Yes. Uh, but yeah, I, I hand over the three. Yeah, you have, uh, you have your diamond. Ah. <sighs> Thank you, my good sir. Alright, Sona. I'm done. Anything you need to do? Um... I'm gonna look around. Alright, what are you looking for? Um... Gold. Gold. Like, golden stuff? Or, like, coin? I yeah. mean, we're really looking for golden stuff. I mean, we're in the right shop for it. Mm -hmm. Alright, give, give me a perception check. Alright. Uh, you would see that he does have a few, uh, like, gold, uh, stuff. Gold jewelry. Uh, underneath, uh, glass. Uh, you would also see that he has a safe in the back that he probably keeps most of his coin in. Okay. Are there earrings? Uh, yeah, there would be a handful of earrings that have uh, different gems uh, inlaced in them. Um, hey Rowan. Yes. What gems do you think would suit me? Hmm. Give me one second. Out of character, I need to look at your player picture because I can't remember 100% <laughs> what you look like. That's okay. Da, da, da. Scroll, scroll, scroll. Is it in? Let's see it. Mm -hmm. Well, it's not pinned, but it's it's up uh, there. Okay. Ah. Oh, your complexion. I would say either a dark sapphire or a dark ruby. Mm -hmm. Are either of those there, Ninja? Uh, yeah, you'd be able to find uh, some earrings like that. Great. I'll buy one of each. Alright, I would run you about uh, 80 gold. Okay. That's it. That's all I wanted. Uh, Vodak, what would you like to be doing? Vodak? Mm -hmm. What would you like to be doing? I'm gonna check on the Tavi. Furiously scribbling in a, uh, in a letter. 
He is. He's just like in the corner of the room, writing on a single piece of paper, pausing, writing hey. again. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Why are you talking like that? Well, I just I talked to him here a little bit ago. I was just curious. How you doing? I'm not doing bad. How about yourself? Pretty good. You're not possessed. It looks at you with this look of, are you fucking serious? Listen, man, the last person in our party who started talking to themselves kind of maybe just a little bit, went a little crazy. All right, you have a point. That's fair. Gotta got check in, you know. <laughs> no, I I'm... Want to, uh, you know, have to deal with that again, especially with someone who's closer to my power rate. <laughs> uh, don't worry. I'm not going insane or anything of the sort. I'm just having an interesting conversation. With who? Yeah, well. Not getting any more missions I don't know about, like, instead of just killing bad people, we gotta kill good people now. No, nothing like that. It's... <laughs> it's interesting. <laughs> Apparently... My... Alterations of myself have caught somebody's attention. Who am I that? Gun him, gets a wool. Pretty I sure will, it's an apparition. Can I make a, a religious check to see if that name is any sort of familiar to me? Absolutely! As I am a pilot. Yeah. Alright. God, me being a paladin is actually useful. <laughs> yes, correct. Thank God. Thank God my religious check is a dog shit for once. <laughs> Last few times have been a little bit more rough. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Fucking hell. Hey, buddy. Fucking walks in like that. I swear to God, I'm going to smack the shit out of you. <laughs> That's the exact way I heard it when he said it. And I was so happy to see that it was in Kiss. I was like, ah, oh, yes. How you doing? Hey, bud. You do know that that uh, thing you're talking to is a uh, elder brain dragon trying to turn the world into mind flares. Really? Yeah. <laughs> so maybe, uh,. Stop talking to it. I mean, I could. You should. What is an elder brain dragon? Should, do I need to make a roll on that? You know what? Uh, give, give me a history check. We'll, we'll see if you uh, if you know specifically what it is. Otherwise, you'll know the you'll know generically what it is. Is that a history? Yep. I out of character know, and I'm not gonna lie, this isn't disincentivizing me at all from going along with this. I know. Uh, you know what it is generically. You know that it's uh, has to do with a uh, mind flayer's uh, elder brain, uh, basically breeding with a uh, dragon to form a over the top. I just want to turn everything to mind flayers. Piece of shit. Well, I know it's not necessarily a good entity to be talking to, and I'd really hate to have another, uh... God, what, what's her name? Horu. Not Horu. Oh. The person I beheaded. What was her name? Oh, jeez. <laughs> God, that was so long ago. It was. Either <laughs> or. I would have to hate to have to have that happen again. Or I may need to, uh, while you're doing something, relieve your sh head of your shoulders. I don't think that's going to be necessary. You see, we said that when we talked to the witches, and yet there we were. <laughs> Listen, none of y'all have ever told me the full story on that, so... So here's the deal. Uh, 
this this lady, this Lestardi, you know, I believe she had made a deal with the witches so she could shut off her get emotions and commit fully to her cause, which made her totally okay with burning her own city down, destroying Fremor, Darum, and all the country, like the entire continent, and just reveling in that, including killing her son. So uh, to stop that, I had to take her head from her shoulders. Hmm. So if there's a situation where you suddenly are now in contact with this elder, elder brain mind flare dragon shit, uh, and you get into a similar situation, I will kill you. We're friends. I hold nothing personal to you. I don't blame I hate you. you. You're fine. But That's for fair. the safety of these people, I will kill you. I'm aware. I don't blame you for that in the slightest. I'd do the same. Alright, as long as we're clear on that, continue as you were. We're actually going to go back to his chair and just wait for the rest of his group once they're done and uh, once everyone's back in the ship, we'll head back on our way. Yeah, I'm sure Rowan and I will come back after we're done. Yeah, you'd be, you'd be coming back about this time. Okay. Okay, my brain's tripping a little bit. Out of character. <laughs> yes. Uh, this kind of looks like the beginnings of a foot. I'm sorry, what? I told you, it's crazy. But like those two, that looks like a pair of toes. That looks like a little toe. It's just so... Oh my god. <laughs> Listen, I haven't had a crazy theory yet. I'm waiting, okay? I'm like, I've, I've been in hyper analyzation mode for the last two campaigns. Between that and the pawn. <laughs> Either or. I'll figure out some sort of crackpot idea. Just you wait, friend. I'm not looking forward to it. <laughs> her name was Seath, by the way. That was her name. Wait, you weren't here for this conversation. That was out of character. I I, I actually forgot Seath. <laughs> <laughs> I knew we had a Lich Darty in the group. Do I, do I remember her name? Please no. tell me that you actually straight up forgot her name was Seath. No, nah, I did, like, legitimately, because it was so long ago. <laughs> Excellent. That was like back at the beginning of the year. Yeah. Coming up on the end. Hey guys, I have an issue. Yes. Yeah. I just found out I don't know what something does and I really want to do it, but then I remember and have flashbacks player wise of the fucking deck of many things. The deck of many decks. Oh, I miss the deck of many decks so I damn bad. Know. I do too. Maybe we'll find it again. My my best bet is probably gonna be around Ulrin. Ulrin. I have a feeling that's kind of why Ninja gave me the item he gave me because it was not to that point, but it has a flavor of it. If we're gonna find any magical items, I feel like the best place to find them is in the magically powered cities. You know. You're not exactly wrong. So if anyone wants to keep an eye out for the deck of many decks and cause chaos in this campaign... <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm just saying, this section... Hey, Ninja. Do you want to use them? Ninja. Yes. Would a raggedy-looking bag with a raggedy deck count as a trinket? You know what? Sure. Oh yeah, Rowan's gonna be looking for that shit. If she sees oh, that, she's grabbing god. it. Oh my god, I love it. We tie in the coordinates. So, are you guys going to pass through the chasm at this point, or...? Oh yeah. Alright. 
What if you would find it? one remaining bridge that is sturdy enough to hold uh, this tank. Thank fuck. You can continue your way on through the city and out the northern side. Yeah. Uh, thank fuck there was a bridge. Cause if there was a bridge, we were about to have a long walk. I mean, it would take a while, but over the course of a week, I might be able to mend the bridge. Sounds like it'd take a long time. I don't hear a no from God, so I'm gonna assume it's a yes. I mean, that makes the wild assumption that there's a bridge that can support this. I mean, yes, but... Wait, you could just hear your God? Sometimes. That's crazy. I get to talk to mine whenever I want to. Well, that's because you're the weird. Yeah. I set up an appointment to talk to my god. <laughs> not able to commune with your god? Imagine him walking into an office, being like, yeah, can I... Can he walks into the me? temple and he's like, ah, yes, I would like to talk to my god. Ah, uh, sorry, we don't have any appointments open until Tuesday. <laughs> All I'm hearing is that, like, Vodak walks in, open, opens the doors to the temple, and it's just like an office, like, with, like, a secretary, and then behind him is just cubicles. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like it's oh, the waiting room. Sorry, he's currently in a meeting right now. Uh, can we uh, pencil you in for uh, next Wednesday at uh, three o'clock specifically? If you're two minutes late, uh, we're, we're gonna have to move up the next appointment. We 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 have a very busy schedule. <laughs> <laughs> if you're two minutes late, we are that. going to explode the city. No, I wouldn't do that. But it's, it's like uh, absolutely next no, no. Person in the line. Ne next person in line. Come on, chop chop. <laughs> chop 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 chop. All right, now for the long trek to Halifax. I just imagined, like, uh, like a thing that says you have to come in 15 minutes early to make sure you don't miss your spot. <laughs> Love it. Long trek to Halifax, and then to this box. Is that the is that the tower or? You have no idea. Box? You've never been to uh, the Lich Darty cities. Either or, Hallows Kim is definitely the first stop. Or Clorox, if you want to go a little bit farther. I expect their city is really clean. No, Vodax, you really can't just, like, sit down in the community with your god. I mean, you might answer. It's not guaranteed. I might get somebody completely different. Last time I really tried communing with my god, I spoke to him, but I was in contact with the dwarf that built this for a really long time. Oh, oh, see. Do paladins not get the spell commute? I don't know. I haven't played a paladin in so long, I honestly don't know. Let's take a look. Uh, no, it's only cleric spell. Oh! Interesting. Okay. You guys are like a roided out paladin. Uh, we're, we're much more squishy than paladins are. I'm no, sorry. I, mean I just pictured like a bodybuilder cleric and just like full on scene and be like, Hur! and then isn't like, that the... like the fi isn't that like a regular fin tan? Yeah. So, I like to... <laughs> so, but here's the thing: like, then it like slides over to like the paladin. And it's like a skinny dude in a suit. <laughs> it's like, yeah, like... clerics are just roided out paladins. It's fine. I like to imagine that physically, paladins are rewarded out clerics, and magically, clerics are rewarded out paladins. <laughs> yeah. That's why. That's why I kind of meant. I don't know why, but my brain picked up on like a holy version of like uh, like steroids, like just like injecting like holy water into your bicep. Like, yes, I feel the power of God. <laughs> <laughs> really crazy clerics shoot it into their eyeballs I can see God just imagine you go into a temple and like you push open the back door and you see like four clerics just like injecting and it's like what is that holy water I'm just gonna close this door now 
Uh, yeah, I walked where I wasn't supposed to go. <laughs> We're just gonna leave that alone. <laughs> no. So, uh, <laughs> as you guys travel north, you would start to see a uh, mountain range that uh, feeds into the uh, the rivers uh, come into view. Uh, oh, nice. But, uh, you would get along the western side as it starts to become nighttime once more. Mm. Alright, so oh, we're doing yeah. the same thing as last time, Ron? Oh, yeah, sounds check. good to me. Okay, right. What did I find in the temple? Of this box? Uh, I'm sorry, what? Remember, I said I was going to use my eye to look for the most valuable item. What did I find? It, in the ship is the last time I heard you saying you were going to use that. What? No, I said I was going to get off and, and uh, explore the, the... What's it called? It starts with a C. It was like... Huh? Yeah, so whatever. Or we'll Rowan's out. Not a catwalk. The crow's no. nest? No! I want that back. <laughs> you ain't getting it back. I'll build my own. <laughs> I mean, you could, technically. I'm, exactly. I'm picturing it being built on top of, like, the hatch up top, <laughs> so every time you open the hatch, you just fully flip down the crow's nest. <laughs> I mean, at that point, she'd move it. I can see her building it there the first time, which would be kind of funny. <laughs> anyway, uh, I mean, it would be the holy symbol at the center of the, uh, the temple. Oh. Well, I'm gonna ask my god if I'm allowed to touch that. <laughs> no. No, you are not. Oh. Mom, can I have a cookie? <laughs> no, th this is in the art museum, and it's like, Mom, I want to touch that really sparkly-looking thing. Come on, let me touch it. <laughs> it's like, no. Spot ten. no. I love that Hestu just wa I just met her walking to a temple, just like, God, God, am I, am I allowed to fuck with this? The problem no. is it's also not oh. God. It's, it's a fucking It's entity. my God. Yeah. My God. Technically, no. <laughs> it's your patron. Eh, same difference. No. Fine. Absolutely not. <laughs> why? Why not? This is why you get direct communication. <laughs> <laughs> the teachings aren't enough. We need to babysit. No, I just imagine, like, like, uh, the patron, like, to everyone else just, like, hands out, like, you know, little things here and there to Hestia just in her head. No, you can't do that. Stop. Uh, you know, for some reason I thought it was going to be a bunch of pamphlets saying beware of this child. <laughs> anyway, I need to start I'm... manufacturing those. Those would make a killing. Um... Before going to sleep, I'm going to use crate food and water. All right. So if anyone's hungry or thirsty, here you go. I'll do that in the cabin downstairs. And uh, I'll set up the guardian and I'm going to go to fuck to sleep. I'll take watch two and three again. Alright. Alright. All right. Give me perception. What up? Hey, uh, some Tobby to feed me rock candy. Alright. Sure. You know what? Uh, he's over here working on making a corpse work with four arms, but that's fine. Turns to you with bloody hands. What? <laughs> he does. Absolutely. 100%. No. No, I just imagined how he's staring you in the eyes. Did I stutter? I said rock candy. I didn't ask what you were doing. I said rock candy. <laughs> Go on, feed your way, child. It's... Yeah, I will. Hell yeah. Yeah, be a Do I... mommy. <laughs> Shut the fuck oh. up. Actually, I'm gonna set the tent to sleep, sorry. Tommy's a guy, it's not a mom. It doesn't matter, it's the same energy. 
<laughs> no, it's not. Would you prefer to call him Dommy Daddy? Yeah. Do it. No. I'm <laughs> <laughs> glad you asked. Bodak, roll perception, please. Never. <laughs> he just no, wants to go on on forever. So go on way, Ninja. Do I make progress with the actual corpse? Uh, you can make most of the uh, modifications to attach it to you, though. self surgery is going to take a lot more time and a lot steadier place than this. Hmm. If I animate it, will it be able to move relatively, like, nor, like, properly, I and shouldn't say. Animated how? I'm a fucking necromancer. That was the answer I needed. Uh, I mean, it would move kind of like a hand, but, like, more dragging. So it's still not actually functioning properly in terms of being another arm? Oh, like... Putting it on you. It wouldn't be on you yet. This would be like... No. Yeah, I know. The day. Yeah. So, no, I'm, I'm testing this on a, on a corpse. How you could animate it to be mostly like a uh, another arm, though. It's a little delayed. A little delayed. Okay, okay, interesting. Like, if somebody were to throw a ball for it to try and catch, it probably would not be able to catch it. Like, it'd be like a, a second behind trying to grab it at the spot. Mm -hmm. Not bad, not bad. So the muscles are proper. It's just like a nerve modification that I need to work on. Sure. Okay. Uh, Vodak. Uh, mm -hmm. it's, it's a quiet night except for the, uh, the sound of uh, body parts flopping around in the back of your ship. Probably nothing. It must have been the wind. <laughs> Someone must have farted. Must be nothing. I'm sorry, god damn it. That brought me way back to Skyrim. Yeah. Arrow sticking out of their face. Must have been the wind. <laughs> uh, god, true, true NPC vibes right there. Yep. <laughs> must have been the wind. Everything fine. To be fair, he is a town guard. Uh, you know. Uh, regardless, uh, your ship comes to a close. I'm gonna wake up Rowan and go off to bed. Wakey, wakey, Rowan. I will be right back. <laughs> there are no eggs in Bake You. But there is. Eh, yeah, you didn't promise it this time when you woke me up, so it's okay. There is work to be done. Yes, yes, there's always work to be done. Uh, would you like to sleep in the tent, or should I take it down? I take it down. Oh, I like I sleeping on the cold middle said. floor. Oh. So. I'll be taking down the tent. Alright. Rowan, I'm gonna have you roll me a, uh... Perception? A perception, yeah. Alright. Night is, uh, fairly peaceful, uh, you do see the occasional thing, uh, up on the mountaintop watching you, but after a while it disappears and you don't see it again. See what? You're not really sure what it is, but something was watching you from up on the mountaintop for a little while. From up on top, like on top of the ship? No, like on top of the from mountains. Up. Ah, okay. Top of these, these mountains right here. Yeah. One of these three, I don't know which one exactly. I mean, most western ones, because that's the only one you can see. Well, it wasn't as big as the other dude, so I'm not really worried about it. That's fair. Uh, but eventually the, uh, the dawn would uh, rise and you would uh, find yourself ready to uh, carry on with the day. Wait, you right. did you see my message? I did. Hey, Zach, you Good. back? Yeah. You're gonna hate this. Ah. <laughs> That's just in your dream, uh, eating rock candy while waving. Fuck, I was right, it was Hestia that had the rock candy. You know what, Tatavi is just gonna <laughs> nod and wave and just kinda think, Oh, right, she can do that now, how fucking lovely. <laughs> well, no, it only happened the second time. It 
could be worse. Yeah, that I, it could be. Like, she has complete control of your dreams. That's fine. Yep. Fuck it. It could be worse. I could be about to shove a tadpole into my ear. <laughs> you know, Question, Ninja. Yes. Where it says that I can make the ground trimmer some, would that uh, include that I can make the ship kind of trimmer a little? As a part of what? Therma chi. Because I, mean, I can never pronounce that bit. right. Huh? Mm -hmm. You can make the ship vibrate a little bit. Okay. I'll do that as like a wake up call. Oh, good. Um, you know. Shrek's um, pockets frantically. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, I don't have that yet. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> That's not that time period. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. That ninja. <laughs> We, we've outed the time traveler. How? We vibrated the ground and he checked his pockets. That's when we knew the game was up. <laughs> How did you know that? Is it? You're also a time traveler. Oh, <laughs> the cat's out of the bag, or should I say, the phone's out of the pocket. Ha ha! Ah. You just, they just both suss each other out as a time traveler right then and there. <laughs> but, uh. But, uh. Ninja. One of our cats' dream reminds me that uh, one dream Brownies had a long time ago with Ashley. I don't want to think about that. Why not? It's you're the one who came up with it. What's up? Can there? you tell me how to pronounce that properly? Thaumaturgy. Uh, my brain just goes, yeah, no. Thaumaturgy? Is All that right. right? So, you know how to say turgy, right? Like Turgy? Yeah, so like metallurgy, uh, fuck, bra bra brain stop there, uh, shit like that. So like, you take Thaumaturgy. like turgy, yeah, and then down like Skyrim. It just sounds so weird. Like it, it feels like I'm putting rocks in my mouth and trying to talk around it. <laughs> I, I enjoy the fact that you can say prestidigitation without a problem, but thaumaturgy stumps you. Listen, when I was younger, I used to have a lisp. And when I say lisp, you can still sometimes hear. I have not noticed. Man. The English language sucks. Anywho, uh, Ninja. Yes. Getting up in the morning, provided we're still traveling and nothing's going on, I'm gonna go ahead and continue working on, well, the forearmed idea, but I'm gonna try and... Let's try and add more nerves. Pretty much give the brain different pathways to trigger the muscles in these arms. Alright. Because by the logic of nerves in general, that should cause them to function normally, but it might tax the brain a little bit. Probably. You know, your grilling cleric can assist you so that you have advantage of doing it better, because I know health stuff. Sure. Want to help out? Yeah. All right. Someone else Medic has to steer the ship, though. Medicine advantage, I'm guessing, Ninja? Sure. Okay. I, I mean, I'm just curious. Yeah. What is your medicine, Toby? Plus 13. That's amazing. And she still hasn't rolled over a 25. <laughs> Me or Rowan? <laughs> you. I got a fucking 33, thank you very much. <laughs> Ninja forgot how to count. No, I just wanted to okay. give you shit. Mm, so, Tommy. I would do the same. You know you're doing this whole arm thing? Yeah. What if you, like, gave yourself a pill? <coughs> you can breathe underwater. Why are that the webs? I can breathe point? underwater. You can? Yeah. But you don't have gill, which is the cool part. Opens up the flax on his- opens up the flaps on his face and just leans over to the point that his skin is actually showing. Gills. Why haven't you put the webbing right, between your toes? I mean, I can already swim. Yeah, but wouldn't that, like, make you Actually, better at it? Yeah. Probably. I'm more like interested in being able to run fast. What if the world floods? What's running gonna do you then? I mean, I can swim as fast as I can run. What about those lizards who, like, run on water? Would it be like a basilisk? That? I don't know. I thought that was a snake. I mean, provided that I gave somebody, like, toe extensions and then webbed it and altered the muscles in their legs a little bit to be able to stomp that Ooh. fast and that hard, I'm pretty sure I could manage to get some A water, water spider. 
Now that's just a bunch of hairs, and we are way too heavy to cause the surface tension not to break under the weight of a spider. Like, <laughs> under the weight of us, rather than a spider. <laughs> I can't believe I just got into with that. No, uh, I just, I hate it, because I'm reminded of the fucking, like, Reddit, like, chains, where it's like, that's not that, it's this. And the next one be like, that's not that, it's this. And it's, <laughs> my brain immediately went to that, and I hated it. Will, will, will. So, and Ninja, how does... Oh, sorry. Go ahead. No, you're all good. I was just gonna say, like, Rowan now is not gonna be opening doors with her hands. She's just gonna be used to the all the time. Mm. So get used to that. Oh, I the mean... door's randomly open. Oh, it's Rowan. Fair enough. I mean, but, uh... Tabby, if... Yes. You keep adding mortar, then it doesn't improve it. If I keep what? Um, keep adding more nerves and stuff to it, it does not improve its reaction time. It can't be the distance. The legs react in the same, like... Yeah, but... Uh, okay, technically, you will react quicker to shorter the distance, but... It's not really perceivable to humans. Exactly. Legs function, <laughs> like... Zombie just gets the fuck up. You thought it was just a corpse. M the legs move fucking normally. It's just the extra arms. Can I try branching the nerve pathways off of the spine near the other arms? I mean, sure, you can attempt it. Alright. Oh, oh. Thank you. Because I think this is cool. There we go. Oh, look, over 25. <sighs> Meanwhile, in my last three medicine checks, two of them have been nat 20s. <laughs> yeah, but it's fun to give you shit. Yeah, it is. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I mean... You can get it to sort of work. It's still very strange and abnormal for it. It's doesn't work 100% the way you want, but... Is it able to punch with set arms? Yes. You want it to punch Rowan? No, I don't. Oh, alright. <laughs> Please don't. I just want to see if it can actually... Con like, if I'm basically directly taking control of this undead mentally if it's able to like actually assume a stance and strike with relative consistency without like impeding itself by having these arms well it's absolutely impeding itself it's it's limited to where it can put its arms yeah true How drastically is it impeding itself? Well, uh, fairly. It, it's... Again, it's like this skeleton is not set up to be like this. You're doing a very ab, ab natural thing. Y yes ninja! <laughs> Hence why the offer I was given was interesting. Yes. All right, well. Would I be able to actually gain some practice in figuring out a decent way to move properly using this uh, zombie in terms of the maximum amount of efficiency to strike a multitude of times with these arms, just in terms of the movement aspect of it? I feel, you feel like it's probably a uh, slower than uh, normal. Well, yes. I'm, I'm not trying to do this fast. I'm trying to, like, figure out the optimal method of moving these limbs without them impeding each other. Well, uh, it's probably going to take some time. Yeah, but I'll just practice with it before I actually attach this to myself and fuck myself over. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. 
was just like, I wonder if I would get anything to put in four arms. I mean, <laughs> probably because, like, that creature's name is four arms. Anyway, uh, what would the rest of you like to do on this day where Tatabi's committing uh, gross scientific horrors? Oh, don't worry, you'll pay for that later tonight. Mm, uh... <laughs> Your dream is just gonna be a single dildo in a blank white room and nothing else. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> just no, it's not! <laughs> One day someone's gonna make the mistake of entering Bodak dreams. I'm oh, just dear. sticking around to assist Tatabi. I think this is cool. Yeah. Thank you. Where are we again? <laughs> I'm so sorry. It's all good. We've no, gone wait. across the chasm, so we're up on our way through here, right? We're probably mm -hmm. sitting somewhere around this area right here. Possibly. What we know about DNA... No. no. Okay. Okay. We're not that smart, okay? It's still medieval time. <laughs> I mean, there's just some really randomly highly technological things and I just like to know where things are sometimes. I mean, that's a lie. This isn't medieval. This is the industrial period. I mean, yes, there are, some, there are some high, highly advanced stuff, but for a very specific reason, for a very specific set of purposes. Oh, I know. It's like, I'm wondering if medicine has gotten to that point. That's why I was asking. Maybe in Old Rain? Yeah. I, I'd figure that if the if anybody was to know, like, that in-depth about medicine, it would be Lichstardi, especially the Pales. That's like a, that's like a light baby. But we understand evolution, though. We're asking a lot. I mean, evolution came out a long time before DNA. We 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 have a lot of questions too. <laughs> I mean, kind of. Though it, evolution doesn't work quite the same way in this universe, because again. Oh, well, obviously, yeah. I'll be right back. Hey, Tatabi, if you were a kid, do you think they'll end up getting any of the traits that you added on? Or would they just be with their base traits? I highly doubt they'd gain anything because I wasn't born this way. If hey, I'd have to guess, I to be even, honest. I don't even think you can make kids, can you? I have no idea. Make what? Children. Kids, apparently. I mean... I, I hate the fact that I'm not playing a dirty character right now or I'd say some shit. <laughs> Like, there's only one way to find out. I would totally say that if I was playing a different character. Oh, I meant, like, build a child. If I did the medicine check, could I tell whether or not Satabi could have children? I I don't think I want to let you figure that out by yourself. You know what? Sure, you why not? We're already going to atrocities. Go for it. I'm just find out. There's only Tatabi. one way to find out, Rowan. Tatabi so. over here immediately trying to run out the door. So medicine trip with disadvantage. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you can run, but you can't hide. Uh, there is muffled screaminess. Rowan's like, Wait, I need to know for science. <laughs> if Tatabi's trying to run out the door, I'm going to slam the door in her face. With Dermot, fucking his <laughs> in her face. <laughs> I just imagine Rowan over here, like actually figuring this shit out eventually. Like everybody's been saying it, but she doesn't fucking believe it. So she keeps calling Tatabi a woman, and then she sees a dick, and she's like, "Oh wait a second, they weren't kidding." Oh wait, wait a well, dick girl. We're good. You have you have so many added parts. You could just you added start... that dick on there. <laughs> 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 I'm not gonna judge you for it. I mean, you want four arms? Sure. You want a dick? Sure. I'm not gonna also judge you gonna... for this. Tatabi looks at the dick. <laughs> Literally, it's just like a fucking echidna's where it's got four heads. No, no, it's just normal. And she's like, so, uh, who'd you, uh, pick this from? Hmm? <laughs> oh my god. I just want this to be a thing now, that because Rowan's never really took the time, she just thinks Tatabi's a girl for some reason. I mean, Tatabi could probably have kids so long as down below parts aren't replaced, or replaced with working parts, probably. Hey, Tatabi, good news. I don't want to hear it, <laughs> as he says, just looking at this fucking door that slammed in its face. <laughs> oh, okay. Rowan opens the door back. You gonna walk through the door? 
No. <laughs> <Let's> <laughs> find out. So what did we find out today, class? Not to try to run for real. We found out Tatabi's pregnant. <laughs> oh my god! I am going to punch the shadow of every single one of you, I swear to god. <laughs> Listen, I just checked. Tatabi is not pregnant. Alrighty, anyway, <laughs> out of my fucking room, please. I like that. Oh, Adding extra arms gills, a tail. <laughs> All perfectly fine. Talking about pregnancy? Nope. Correct. Tatabi has a very strange set of things he's mentally okay with thinking about. Yes, I know. <laughs> Can't we're making fun of it. Oh, God. Anyway, uh, so the day is progressing onwards. <laughs> <laughs> Not much is going to happen today outside of your shenanigans as nobody's paying attention. I was not paying attention? What? Yeah, shut up. Unheard of. I know exactly where we are. Nice. God damn it. <laughs> Great. It's night time again. Hmm? Alright. Wait, is it actually? Yeah. Have, have we gotten into mountains or anything like that? No. You guys will go around. We're going to the west. We're going. Like, what are you? Well, yeah, but we're gonna have to cross some mountains to get to Alakami. Yeah. Maybe. It's gonna take a bit. We're like all the way down here. Welcome back, Buddha. You missed a lot of fun. Oh my god! So are you fucking serious? God damn it! Nice. Amazing. All right, Sona, you're the only, the only one to understand this uh, joke, but I'm just going to type it. All right, get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly how it happened, too. Did just get? Yes, it is. That's why it's so much better. <laughs> Boom, pregnant. All right, Hush, yeah. what's it going to be like? <laughs> okay. Don't worry, this one's a good one. Is Tatavi gonna be pregnant in it? Oh my god. Maybe. <laughs> See, Tatavi, this is the kind of stuff you foster when you uh, decide to break nature. You know what? I've been doing it pretty much every campaign. It's fine. I'm used to it. I'm gonna do the normal night ritual of making some food for everyone and setting up the guardian and going into my tent. Alright. All right, there we go. Nice. God damn it! What so, is it? Tasabi, you have a dream where uh, you look like you uh, you did before. Uh... No, no, uh, no, <laughs> no. Well, I mean, I... so back when the party first found you, but uh, you look like a girl, and you're pregnant. Oh my god. Didn't say the pregnant part. Just yeah, gonna sit yeah, down. Yeah, but I did. <laughs> <laughs> you're, just, <laughs> you're just gonna. He, Tatavi's just gonna sit the fuck down and meditate in the dream. Don't you mean she? I hope you know I was talking about the drawing. The drawing yes, I know. Yeah, yeah, good. Also, don't you mean she? <laughs> She's gonna go back to meditate. <laughs> He's just gonna. He's just gonna meditate in the dream. <laughs> He's used to Hestia's shenanigans. He's honestly kind of happy she's back. It makes things fun. <laughs> so I assume the same layout is gonna be uh, watching. E. All right. God, why are these all just fucking pregnant gifts? God <laughs> damn it! What have I started? <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and roll. <laughs> What am I rolling? Perception. Hun, I just want you to know... Mm -hmm. I just want you to know that they're making fun of my male character saying he can get pregnant. And I had nothing to do with it. <laughs> no, no, you did. You, you did. definitely did. No, you can't. But a character can control his dreams, so he is a pregnant female in his dreams. Yes. Wait, we never said anything about you being a female. Ever. No, I did. No, no. Yes. No, okay, I did. you did. He is female. So, but I... The reason why is that the drawing that he sent looked female. 
Bodak, you can he hear, was a twink uh, in life. Tatabi's grumbling <laughs> as uh, she toss he tosses and turns in his sleep. Why you almost said she? God, no, I did say it. she. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I am going to kill so many people. <laughs> like just full turns, looks back at the door. Eh, must have been the wind. Turns back around. Literally, like takes hands off of controls, assumes like the fucking T pose. Turns around, must have been the wind. Turns around, resumes controls. Exactly. <laughs> and then, uh, after my ship comes to close, I'll wake up rolling oh, and go to sleep. I right. never wanted to see a gif of Arnold fucking Schwarzenegger saying he's pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> I could have gone my entire life without that. <laughs> Here, gone. Thank you, thank you. But you didn't. <laughs> God, I have <I'm> <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean to roll about it being normal. Oh my god. Yeah, you are sitting there just the occasional <laughs> and you just keep driving. <laughs> but it's a quiet night. Oh my god. God damn it, honey! <laughs> <laughs> what did she do? I'm just gonna post what she DM'd me in OOC chat. <laughs> <laughs> So I, thought, I, thought she was just, I thought she was just gonna go behind you and whisper into your ear, congratulations. <laughs> I, I, I'm tempted to tell her that you said that, but at the same time, she's do gonna it. do it if I do, and do I'm gonna it. flip my shit. You know what? Do sure, it. why not? He said, I just wished that she went up right to your, in right next to your ear without letting you know, and said, congratulations. <laughs> She enjoyed that. She thought that was quite funny. Yeah, that's because it is. It is. Anyway. What the f- ah, no! What is that? Ninja, get the fuck away from me! It's your child. I'm gonna block your ass just to be like, no. Okay. So, uh, Rowan, <laughs> morning arrives. Quite, quite sooner than you were thinking. God damn it. <laughs> I'm gonna do a little trimmer again to wake up everyone. Alright. <laughs> Morning trimmers! Do y'all hear her just cackling in the fucking background? Yes. A little bit. It's beautiful. You've done this. And I'm also kind of appreciative of it, but at the same time, I'm disturbed and I will not sleep tonight. It's, a, it's all good. Morning is come, so you know. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm sorry to talk, honey. No, you're fucking not. Don't lie. No, this was earned. Anyway. Hey, I all I did was one more anyways. What would y'all like to do? Uh... Hey, Tatabi. <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, I'm gonna make some... <laughs> do we have, like, a flame or something? Sure. I need a flame. Ah, here, a tinderbox. I have a flamethrower. No. Flamethrower! Anyway. Bolt. I want you to concentrate on this flame. Okay. If it turns blue, you're pregnant. <laughs> he is not going to respond. You see the flame turn blue anyway. Congratulations, oh. me. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I honestly thought you were just gonna go blows out flame. I was tempted. I was also tempted to make all seven strikes directly by your face without hitting you. <laughs> anyway. But, but for the moment, sitting at the front, just chuckling slightly. <laughs> must have been the wind. <laughs> <laughs> must have been the wind. <laughs> I am actually, Ninja, for today, considering the fact that I've gotten the forearms down to as good as I'm gonna get them, like, they're just impeding each other, which I can't really do anything about. I'm just gonna have to adjust my own movements. 
Uh, we're gonna go ahead and try and alter those arms to the whip arm. Alright. I'll assist again, and I'll stop Thank talking you. about pregnancy stuff. I appreciate that. I don't want to upset an expecting father. I am... <laughs> why, not, why not just put centipedes on your arms? Listen, Vodak, do you have giant centipedes? No, but I'm pretty sure we could find some. <laughs> when we do, I will do so, but for the moment. Right. Um, I'm gonna punch uh, the Tabi in the stomach. It won't hurt. Oh no, it's gonna be lumpy. Oh, maybe it will hurt. No, Tabi here, like, feels you punch him in the stomach and literally just turns to you and, like, takes a horse stance and just goes, keep doing it. Uh... Three more times. Perfect. Hey, Rowan, do the flame trick again. <laughs> it turns purple. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! <laughs> what does this mean? You know what? Fuck it. I. This is how I'm picturing ancient shamans. Is just somebody fucking bullshitting their way with magic. It, if this turns blue, who wants to know if they're pregnant? <laughs> Goddamn. <laughs> Side note, Rowan, uh, if you go back to the actual thing I drew of the muscle structure of this, since you're assisting me of it, I want to actually have one bone. There's no connecting bones. There's a, like an actual kind of structural point where the muscles are going to connect in the center of the arm. Mm -hmm. And aside from that, it's mainly what I've done in the actual image, which is figuring out where the subdermal muscles and tendons are going throughout all of this. And mind you, the picture on the right here is anatomically accurate. Okay, but you say there's no bone that they're attached to. Aside from in the center, where I'm trying to get everything, like, to actually attach similarly to an elbow joint, but without any hard bones in between the elbow joint and the rest, so it's just flexible muscle. It's basically stability. <clears throat> I mean, technically, you can work without an elbow, but it'll make it the lower part of the arm weaker. Correct. Hence the uh, goal of the structural stability by having an actual point for the tendons and muscles to attach, but excluding the bones. I don't expect his arms to be as strong. Like, he'll certainly not be able to lift as much. He, I'm honestly entirely willing to sacrifice power for speed. I mean, to be able to go fast is because the muscles are pulling on anchor point. Yes, I have put an anchor point in the center. Honestly, don't know enough about muscles and bones if that would work out without an elbow. Not with the shape that you're wanting. Like, if it was just one long thing, yeah. I mean, I'm not exactly I can, sure. I can tell you one thing. You're definitely going to snap some bones. Is that in reference to the fucking whip snapping? Well, yes and no. You. The only part of a whip that's going to hurt is the end. Exactly. And so you're absolutely going to snap whatever bone is holding that end piece together. There are no bones on the actual end piece. You have to have something on the end. A hand. I bet you would probably tear, uh, tear the muscles then. It's a possibility, but hence why I'm experimenting on a body. I have a question for Ron. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, am I pregnant? Uh, I don't know. Stare at this flame deeply. He stares at the flame. Cast fireball. <laughs> oh, I'll be right back. <gasps> You're pregnant and it's twin girls. What? Yeah, it just turned a really bright pink. How did I get pregnant? I don't know. The Dobby? You shouldn't have been in hit. You shouldn't have been in his dreams. Like, oh. No, no, I, I would oh, like no. to reiterate this. <laughs> Multiple times they've been like they sleep together, so you know. Yeah, they sleep together. Oh, okay. Yeah, probably Satoshi. 
You know, unironically, she doesn't understand better and doesn't know who else it would be, so she would think it's to Dobby. Unironically. Dobby's going to have to pay a lot of child support. Mm. It's expensive raising a baby in this environment. <laughs> Can't wait till winter gets back. You're going to have to pay child support for two girls. See, look, he's left already. He, he's becoming a dad. He's never really okay, Stan, if you don't want to have the children, give me two gold and I can make them go away. Falcon! Come back. I, I don't like the fact that I came back to give me two yeah. gold and I can make the children go away. <laughs> You're a father now to Tommy. Congratulations. What? Uh, I said I was pregnant with twin girls. He said I was pregnant with twin girls. But I don't know who else would... I don't know who... Who would be? Who's that? Estia says you're the only one she sleeps with. Tatabi's just gonna go back to working on the muscles. <laughs> He's gonna ignore everything. He's gonna just do this. You know, Hestia, I can't really tell how long you've been pregnant, so it might have been while you were missing that you got pregnant. Might have been while what? While you were missing. No, I didn't get anything to get pregnant while I was missing. So, uh, well, did you hold anyone's yeah. hand? Nope. You can see mountains in the distance. Only to Tobby's. Nice. We're getting close. Oh. We'll have to try the test again in two days to make sure that it's right. Okay. Sometimes you get false positives. That's for you too, to Tobby. <laughs> Pardon. We need to do the test again in two days to make sure it's not a false positive. I don't care. Okay. So we're, we're almost gonna... there? I mean, mm -hmm. Vodak uh, did see mountains out the front. Yeah, we're getting close. Is it Are mountains there or is it really big hills? Because um, the there's a lot of hills. Mountains. Okay. I think I know what I'm gonna do. Although I wanna message this just to see uh the person's reacting who I'm gonna do this to. But uh otherwise the day is gonna go by fairly quickly. I'll make sure to pray. As per the usual. Alright. Just to give a little extra this time. Because I'm assuming I have offended Kami with this shit. Hestia, just go do it if you're going to do it. Otherwise, don't do it. Yeah, I'm going to do it. Do it, then. Okay. Vodak, I'm looking you. Oh, God. And then after, the, after looking you, she's just going to ask, are we there yet? Slurp. Are we there yet? <laughs> exactly. Just like that. Just Must are we there? In the wind. Vodak, <laughs> <laughs> are you still with us? Yes, I'm still here. All right. Again. Again. But like I said, it must have been the wind. <laughs> <laughs> the wind's feeling awfully wet this morning. <laughs> Probably a chance of rain. <laughs> oh God. I'm sorry, I, I'm thinking about those weather rots that people have, and I fucking hate it. <laughs> but it's, those were amazing. But it's just Vodak with, like, different things that happen, so he just keeps saying it must have been the wind. He's like, he's kind of done with this whole situation, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> Tatabi is gonna hop up on top of the vehicle just to you know take a rest break from everybody and practice sacrificing speed for power in terms of these strikes all right i mean it's sacrificing power for speed my bad i was like if you insist sorry no 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 i'm all right with hitting less hard as long as i hit more soon you'll be able to punch with the force of a pillow but I had a million <laughs> times a second. Honestly, a million <laughs> pillows to the... F Listen, a million anything to the face is going to push somebody back. I don't know that it will. 
Hey, you remember when really that one anything. dude was fighting uh, the big demon, and then he got slammed? Oh, I'm aware, but he did better than all of us. <laughs> Say it. Listen, would you like to be slammed by a million frogs in a second? You would fall over, I'm sorry. So it's because nighttime again? I will be shortly here. Uh... I'm just I'm just looking out practicing my martial arts. Ninja. Yes. <laughs> this does not work. Oh. Well, maybe you should fix it. I don't think I can. Oh, I think you could have. Same way I fixed it. How would that be? I there literally we go. put a space after the JPEG. Yeah, there we go. Oh. Pauses. D d just raw confusion. <laughs> but, uh, continues on. Alright. Uh, we would be getting to nighttime as well. Yay. Okay. Let's uh, go. Vodak, give me another perception check. Um, on it. Alright. Uh, you see that After. that weird, uh... Light uh, again? Yeah. Does it look any bigger? Yes. Any more, like, does it look threatening? Am I... I mean, it just looks like different wisps of light that are currently simply in the city and a cone-shaped formation. A bone-shaped formation? Cone. Okay. Enter the bone dome! I got... I got excited. I thought we were coming to that thing that I released. <laughs> By the way, Tatavi, uh, mm -hmm. this time you fall asleep, but you find yourself waking up, and uh, you hear Hestia saying uh, She's not gonna cast stream on you, and she's just gonna let your creativity take over, and then everything just becomes a black void. <laughs> and you just hear the whisper echoing, "Good night." <laughs> That's fucking creepy as shit. But also, I'm in a black void. Can I lucid dream right now? Because if so, I'm gonna experiment the fuck out no, of like. No, you can't. <laughs> it's just oh god, a black damn it! Void. <laughs> Fuck it, just practice martial arts in my dream. Alright. <laughs> uh, Rowan, uh, go ahead and roll up perception for me. Shut the fuck up, Tiny. Okay. <laughs> We're doing a normal thing and the first one was stuck. I assume, yeah. Uh, or I can study shit. Uh, you would also be able to see the, uh, the strange wisp-like lights that, uh, circle over the city. Would I know what they are? Uh, give me a religion check. One second. Yes, I will uh, send you a message. Thanks. Huh. 
Would I know why they're soul circling the city? You have no idea. Awesome. Anything else in, uh, you'd like to do during that? No, just keep an eye out. Alright. Eventually, uh, daylight would come and you would no longer see those, the lights anymore. And which city was I seeing that over again? Uh, over the general area of, uh, the mountainous region in front of you. Ah. Oh. That's, that's very odd. Anyway, morning rumble. Chick, chick, chick. Oh, I thought I thought Bo I thought Bruce was calling. <laughs> oh, Rick Buzzing. I can truly picture Gretz being like that. Like all the other gods are like, it's fine. We'll go back to like more uh, or less advanced technology. Gretz is like, I want to keep my cell phone. Yeah. <laughs> it's how I call my uh my followers. The other guy's like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen. We can't let you have a cell phone. What about a pager? God, I think that's worse. Honestly, Instead it is. Of a stone of sending, it's a stone of paging. <laughs> no, look, I can be real. Really? It's still a stone of sending, but it's like one way. Could you imagine if all the gods had specific little things they did that actually allowed them to contact their followers? Like, Kami would have a little undead beetle on the back of your brainstem that just allowed her to talk to you. Wait, Gretz wait, would wait, literally wait. have a pager. I think there would be a lot less people following the gods. Ninja, later, it's not like they would know. Later pagers were able to, like, reply back and forth. Yeah, but what if they find I, out? I get that. Okay. Anyway... You guys are, uh, approaching, uh, a city. Finally. Do we know which city it is? I mean, you can take a pretty good educated guess. Do I need to roll, or can I just actually guess? I mean, you, you can actually guess, and I'll tell you if you're probably right. Okay, so can... Yeah. Nice. Yeah. To Toby. Yeah. Yes, he was gonna ask, do you if you enjoyed your sleep last night? It was a black void for eight hours. Oh. That sucks. <laughs> I mean, sounds restful. I just practiced <laughs> martial arts, honestly, I was pretty fine. Thanks. See? Restful. Hmm. Out of character, she didn't do that to you. That was all you. Figures. Anyway. <laughs> so, you guys can see uh, the uh, small uh, timber wall that makes up the edge of the city come into view. Alright. Will we be stopping off here, or...? Mm. Somewhere else. Uh, you mean campaign wise? No, I mean like as a group. All right. If we're stopping at the city, I mean, I'd yeah. like to at least grab a few supplies or some like you know anything. We we could take a break here, we'll take a little look to uh, you know, what I gets out of the ship for like the first time in multiple days. <laughs> oh, so like Looks around. What what does the city look like? Mm. Uh, it's fairly nice looking. Uh, nothing too special. Uh, everything seems to be a one or two story building, and that's about it. I'm gonna see if I can find a better uh, a map of more. It's been updated, maybe a little bit more. That's fair. That way, we can if there's more towns that we haven't seen, then uh, it might have. Do, does the uh, town have a gate? Uh, give me a perception check. Okay. Yep. I mean, unless you get like a one, would you see a gate? Let's see. You Possibly. don't see a gate. 
Uh, Tatapi will, like, kind of walk up to the walls. Nobody patrolling them. Uh, give me another perception check. We'll see. See what you see. Okay. Do you see what I see? Mm-hmm. Uh, you look to the left, you don't seem to be. You look to the right, there's somebody standing right in front of you. Jesus. Oh. Hello. Hello. I'm gonna send a picture of this. Welcome, weary traveler. What brings you to our city? Well. Oh my god, wait a second. We're trying to get the to um, Aldra, and we have uh, terms yes. from Darum and Framor and all that. Against the uh, campaign against Stone. Alright, alright. You guys you... would have to have like updated maps here. Uh, it depends. What maps do you have? On girls, the map that he has. Uh, can't say I've got more knowledge as we've kind of focused inwards as of late. We haven't been looking elsewhere. I kind of, I was a little bit worried, but you know, maybe another town has a more updated map. Someone has to have a more updated map. There's, there, there are new towns that we've come through and passed by that are not on this map. Yeah. Well, I mean, sometimes, ma- you know, towns are just too small to be on the map. But, um... Would you happen to know anybody in the town who excels in anatomical medicine? No. Most right. people here... But to focus on the arcane. Ah, interesting. By the way, right. my good sir, what is your name? I almost said his name was Tim again, and I'm like, nope, nope, can't do it. Can't do it. I need to find the name. Another every Tim. every NPC's name is Tim, just all of them. Look, I'm just saying I'm that considering would, that would make an excellent town. It's like. Ah, let me go get Tim for you. It comes back with another dude. It's like, who's that guy we just talked to? Oh, that's Tim. How, Honestly, how do you differentiate considering... each other? Well, that's Tim. That's Tim. That's Tim. He, that over there is Tim. That's Tim. And uh, that's Tim. What you it don't was, know for Was there that. confusion? <laughs> they have a very small pronunciation at the end of Tim that differentiates all of them. Unless you have good hearing, yeah, yeah. you can't hear it. Literally, it's just yeah, like, that's Tim. That's Tim. That's Tim. That's Tim. Look, as much as I enjoy that, I just like the idea that they're all the same name, and it's just like, to everybody else, it's like, this doesn't make any sense, but to them, it's like, it makes perfect sense. Oh, yeah, it's like the Gary the- Vault in Fallout. Sense. Yes! Who's that-, who's that guy in the corner? Oh, that's Larry. Nobody likes Larry. <laughs> <laughs> that's Larry. We don't talk about him. <laughs> we don't talk about him. Nobody likes him. Oh, my God. Supposedly, he's crazy. the Dark Lord. I love the, the just, who's that over there? Oh, that's Larry. You can call me, uh, Darfin. Darfin? Mm Mm-hmm. Ah, I'm Rowan, and, well, everyone can come now. Can introduce themselves. To Tabi. Well, that was helpful. Ah, several nameless ones. It is a pleasure to meet you. Uh, Oh, you have a name, never mind. Yeah, I'm both back. Pleasure to meet you. Pleasure to meet you. Were you stopping here for supplies, or...? Uh, yeah, mainly. We're gonna stop for supplies, maybe get some food. Stretch yeah. our legs. It, we, I've been in that ship for a long time, and I didn't get out of the chasm. He looks How do you at it. spell his name? D A R F I N. I would certainly like to add some spells to my uh, book if there's a place to do that here. And possibly. Uh, we do have a uh, supply depot. Uh, uh, further into the city, uh, I presume you'll be taking your wagon you know, further in? Uh, depends <laughs> on, well, how much issue that would cause, if any, because we don't want to impede you all. Uh, it should be fine. I, uh, I don't see too much of a problem with it. He, uh, he turns and uh, makes a few gestures, and the wall uh, like rolls itself open. Oh, now that's fucking cool. 
So, Darfin, I just, I need to ask you this. Sure. Where did you get that cloak? We had, we have them made for most of our mages and then enchanted. Oh, so someone who's just traveling through can't get it. I mean, they take quite a while to make. Ah, uh, uh, understandable. Were there any What if it's unenchanted? Like, what if it doesn't have any enchantment on it? How long would it take to make them? I mean, they they still take quite a while. Uh, okay. There's a lot of details in these. Yeah, that's part of the reason I like it. Uh, but he, he would point out a, uh, a two-story building. Uh, that, that building over there, she should, uh, have supplies, uh, That'll help you on your, uh, travel inwards. Oh, thank you. So what would you guys like to do? Oh... I like to I like to look down while whispering to my belly. God, I'm gonna go search for spells to add to my book. Sure, give me an investigation check. Okay. You can't blame Hestia for this. You have to bring we have to blame Rowan for this. <laughs> I wish I could say that's not true, but it's not. Exactly. Uh, you find a uh, a wizard study uh, fairly quickly. Excellent. I will enter, provided the door is open. Oh, there is no door on it. I'll knock. Yes, come in. Come on, chap, chap, let's go. I got stuff tries, to do. Tries to walk through the wall? So, like, there, there is a doorway. Okay. No door. <laughs> All right, well, damn it. I guess I'll just go through this wall. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, not I'll, the weirdest I'll thing. <laughs> we did go through that wall. Yeah, but anyway, <laughs> I'll head on in. Um, apologies for my idiocy. Uh, it is a uh, a male humanoid uh, with no shirt, a long beard, and pointy cap. I'm currently uh, conjuring something. Yes, yes. Come on, spit it out. Would you happen to be able to provide me with a book with the spell of Expeditious Retreat? Uh, let's, let's see if I'll have it. I mean, Tatabi, do you want an image? Yes, I would, actually. This guy sounds... Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute! No, I know the image! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Yes, yes, first, first row, three, three over, just, just copy it down to something, don't bother me, I'm busy. Huh? I will not respond to the fact that I don't want to bother him. <laughs> I hate it, I hate that sort of look. Who the, who the fuck? Of Is that course. the first time she's used that in that? <laughs> I, I have not been paying attention. Oh my god, that's... If you scroll up, you'll see it in some more in some places. Oh my god. Uh, that's awful. It'll take you some time to top you. Yeah, I figured. But, uh... Hmm. Vodek, are you going to go and get supplies? All right. I'm not sure what I really need. I need to get something, I know, but like, I don't know what I really need. How so difficult would it be to find the marketplace? I could get, uh, some potions of healing. Mm. Uh, Rowan, so uh, you can give me a perception check. We're both healers. I don't know, I feel like we gotta get like touristy shit. Trinkets? Trinkets? 
trinkets? Trinkets. Like the same way a golden retriever reacts to like hearing about food or walk. Rowan's head whips around. Trinkets? Yeah, let's go. Let's find something uh, fun and magical just to get. Uh, you're, you're only in the Aldrin territories once. I mean, that sounds like a plan to me. I'll assist you in looking. Screw the marketplace, let's do this first. Oh, uh, do you want investigation or perception into it? Uh, give me perception, why not? Oh, uh, what's your Oh, wait, perception? I got advantage. I forgot you're assisting me. Ah, oh, yeah. I am assisting. Wait a minute. Didn't do much, but it's okay. Wait a minute. Just realized. Is that you're pregnant? That Hestia is not married. How dare you? Yeah, you can fix that. True. Uh... We have to get married at once. No. <laughs> Hey, hey, hey. All Don't right. be hasty. Right. We still need to do the double check in two days. Well, one day now. Okay. So, Vodak, you, Rowan, and now Soda uh, would go to the building that was pointed out, and you find that it's a, uh, it's one guy basically standing behind, like, a, a counter that looks out uh, onto the road as he looks up at you. Ah! Weary Adventures! Come, come! What What is it you seek today? Trinkets. <laughs> Ah, trinkets. Trinkets are always fun. What kind of trinkets are we seeking? Something for the soul, something for the mind, something for the body. Ooh, for the body. Can I interest you in this arcane dildo? <laughs> Pulls out a box labeled sex toys, peels off the sex toys. Sorry about that. It, it was just a prank by my last customer. Here's all the... <laughs> I, uh... I don't... Something that's fun? I don't... Have I got... Cool cards? Cards, cards. Hmm, hmm. We we have trading cards. You know things the youngsters throw around and uh, deck people with. You know cards. Mm hmm. You want some? Sure. <laughs> she slaps down a uh, a small box of cards. You're very aggressive in your sales spend. Yes, yeah, so and you're gonna spend money, aren't you? <laughs> Damn. I am. He's right. <laughs> <laughs> the Shit, only you're right. Magic, the only magic this man needs is a 30 in charisma. That's all he has, that's all he needs. Easy way. Oh, man's uh, already got what it. What items does he means. have? Uh, so, it's weird. He keeps pulling stuff out from underneath the counter, but you don't know how he has this much space. Yeah, how, that's fine. I'm not worried about like, it. Do you have, like, magical cards, like, you can draw and things happen? Like, you're looking to draw something, he pulls out a, uh, what looks like a pen and paper. You can draw cards this way, and then, you know, they just kind of dance around on the page. You're looking for that, that, mm -hmm. No, I mean, like... How about a leather beard? Of... Ooh. Wait a minute. <laughs> I... Say no more, how much? <laughs> God. It's, it's 40 gold. Slaps 40 gold, you have me sold. <laughs> You look like a cleric. You're tired of uh, using uh, press and digitation to clean up. How about a cube that does it for you? Got a cube right here. Slaps out a cube on onto the table. Cleans everything wait, for wait, you. Wait. Just rub it all over and it cleans it right up. Does it clean anything else? Cleans everything. Comes into contact. Um. So you know, I can use it to clean a ship. Yes. Out of, curiosity, out of curiosity, do you know where we could possibly also find a gnome depot? How dare you! <laughs> <laughs> How, How dare you, good sir? These are quality you. products. How dare you, sir? I'm just. You think there's no way you like have a like. You a think trap. we carry their stuff, their cursed ass items that nobody wants to use because they keep coming back to my shop? No, sir. <laughs> Dear God, I think you killed him. <laughs> oh no. How much is the cube? Keep is twenty gold. Oh no. Uh, how many uses does it have a day? 
let, let me double check this before I get this wrong. I think it. Oh my god. I didn't fully read this, but I love it. I'm upset. Uh, you could have come with us. So essentially, you can clean, uh, like, one foot uh, per, uh, for 30 seconds. Just unlimited. And there's uses. no limit on uses? Nope. It just takes time. Oh yeah, my get god. <laughs> okay, I'm getting that cube. Alright. Hey. Well, hey. it's been fun. I got Literally. my leather beard. Uh, we might be back. <laughs> Everyone got what they want? No. Well, no. Wait, I want to ask. You're not here. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you, I am. You told me I was the bandit. cleaning cube stuff? I, I will as soon as this is all done. I've got a bunch okay. of shit pulled up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh. Alright, time for now because all the rest of my money is in the bank and frame one. Uh, terribly sorry to hear that. Why not sit up shop and pray more? Shut up shop. We get a lot of foot traffic. Nah, nah, they, they aren't as magically talented or inclined. The, these people here, we, we love our magic stuff. That's why I'm going to sell you, okay. I'm gonna sell you on this. Table. No, I have smashed potatoes. He, sla he slams the table. Alright, oh. now I'm going to sell you on this. You know how people in Framework aren't magically inclined. The more magical things you sell them, the more interested they are. You see, they haven't seen things like this. You show them this, it'll be caught in the eye. One of them come right to your right to your stall right away. They don't get to see this every day. This is new. This will be brand new, fresh. They would want to come here to, to this cart and buy everything you have. That may be so, but at the same time, I cannot move my shop all the way over there. For you see, my source is here, so it makes transporting goods very easy, which means lower prices for you, which means you can buy more items. But think about this: higher prices in framework. People got more money down there. They got a bank. But think about this, I have a idea. charm. And he sits on a fox head. Like a small metal fox head. <laughs> How would I sell you on this? What, what do you think? You, you think you could use some more luck? You know, uh, f faster browsing speed? You know, the usual. Faster what? Browsing speed, hold up. Faster what? Browsing speed. You, you get to look through items twice as fast. It's nice, it's easy. Helps you improve everything. Uh, I, see, like, I, I won't I remember your passwords, unfortunately. Can I get like a demonstration? House. Good sir, how do you think I talk so fast? Do you think it's because I'm just a simple peasant who has learned all the time? No, this this brings up my speed of literacy and attention span, so I can recall everything that I have in my inventory and sell it to you very for a big free ninja bro. <laughs> You'll get it. You'll get it. <laughs> well, I could kinda already do that. Broken. Not not quite to this speed, good sir. Uh, I have how much question. is it? It is ten gold. Alright, you have a good day. Walked off. <laughs> Find it, sir. Yes. Do you have an item that makes it to where I could access my goal in another in a bank? Oh, let me take a look. I want to know. Oh yes, I do. Most... I do. I do have an item for that. It's called a coin pouch. Slap, slaps one down on the table. Magical will hold most of your coins. Well, at least depending on how rich you are, but it'll still hold most of them. It'll hold them and keep them safe from uh, prying hands, <laughs> if you know what I mean. But it'll keep them safe. It'll uh, keep them secure, and you'll have it on you at all times. I'm guessing this is very expensive. Oh no, ma'am, absolutely not. It's it's a simple sixty gold per per pouch. Um. Hey, Sona? Yeah? Can I borrow 60 gold? Yeah, sure. By the way, he has a really cool pouch that you don't have to worry about people stealing money. I steal money. I know, but that way you don't get double crossed. I'll never get double crossed. <laughs> that oh, just no. sent me a gold Make to steal party. from you. I don't know, Soda. Um, check your pockets. Oh! I don't know, Soda. Check your pockets. Damn! So I would still have to go get my gold for Primal, right? You would, yeah. Okay. Still, so, that's nice. Um, I will get that with the 60 gold I got from Soda. So, I, I wanted to know... Thank you, Soda. 
the most powerful warlock weapon he has. Can you wait your turn? You're not even with us. You were with Seath. I mean, not Seath. You were with fucking. Oh, now you know where to go. <laughs> you were with the Tavi. You said the name, and now it's in my brain. I never said where I was. She did the fuck. You didn't say where you were coming with us either. I don't think I was. I don't even know if I was there. Yeah, that's kind of my fault because I assumed she was with us, so that's why I asked her for gold. Me? Yeah. Yeah. Back. Yeah, I was with you. Yeah, I told him. Sona is with you. Okay. That's yeah, not that's the, the issue why. here. You as hasty is the issue. Why should I be there? I do. You never told us if you were joining or not. Oh my god, then yes. Fuck you. Listen, listen, let her join. Not fair. Everyone deserves trinkets. I want to go to a match shop as well. I don't even know what the fuck Tatabi's doing. Probably messing with dead bodies. That's beside the point. Probably Tatabi things. Yeah, exactly. But shouldn't what the two you... pregnant people be together? You know, she has a point. <laughs> it's... She's right, but at the same time... We don't know yet. So, you gotta make sure your babies are best you friends know. when they're born. Yeah, you never know. It could be born tomorrow. It can? I don't know. Look at this different flame. Oh. Oh, no, it turned yellow. You still have a few months. Oh. I, I, wanna, I still want to know if you can find the best warlock, whatever. I still want you to wait your turn. Oh. No. Fine. Go. Oof. Thank you. Oof. And what is anyway. it you're seeking? Um, I don't know. Do you have any, like, dice or books or shells? That'd be cool. You're looking for shells, dice, or books? Yep. Let me look through his inventory and see what I find. Nothing quite like that, though. I do have something that might interest somebody as magically attuned as you are. S sets down a uh, little uh, stuffed. Uh, uh, fuck. Brain is. Uh, uh, stuffed griffin. Feel like you, you could use one of these. It'll uh, make you casting fine familiar. Just the breeze for you. No, no components necessary, and it'll be nice and fluffy for you. Well, tough customer, tough customer. How about a cloak that predicts the weather? Hmm? Hmm? It's nice and red. No. A deep shit of red. Ooh, no, real tough customer. Mm -hmm. How about a stein that sings? A what? Oh, Lord. A beer stein. Yes, one, one of those. I don't know what that is. It's basically a big beer mug like you would see Vikings hold. Oh, and it does what? It sings. Why would I want that? For entertainment. You look like somebody who hasn't had, had entertainment in uh, about 50 years. That's true, but I don't want singing. <coughs> That's fair. That's fair. Most people don't. How about a dress that has pockets? Alright, Hestia, go ahead. <laughs> Damn. Damn. <laughs> wow. Very tough customer. <laughs> and what can Esty? I do for you, short lady? Uh, uh, powerful warlock object. I have a wand. Oh. What does it do? Wand things? <laughs> I'm convinced. How much? Alright, 100 gold. <clears throat> what, now you have something cool? What the fuck? I would put down 100 gold. He sets down what looks like just a a stick that's been uh, rounded. 
There you go. I am going to pick up the wand and try to to do it. All right, you can spend the time for that. Yay. Uh, let me... By the way, what is your name, good sir? Uh, no, nobody needs to know my name. They just know me as the salesman. I do the best salesman's job around here at all times. This is how supplies and other necessities. Speaking of which, you look like you could use some more rations or uh, maybe some new parts for your, uh, your cart over there. You know what, Miss Edge over there? How about this? It slams down a, uh, a black uh, metal-looking cube. I'm not gonna tell you what it does. It'll tell you the price is two thousand gold. You want to pay two thousand gold for a mystery item? Yes. Deal. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Yo, I'd also take that gamble. <laughs> I love it! I fucking love it! This is one of my favorite characters. I've just got a list of items I can have him, like, basically just try and sell it. I fucking love it. Uh, <laughs> did you guys want anything else from him? I wanted to know if I could also do 2,000 gold for a random item. Hmm. We'll see what the next item I can find is, and we'll see what Percy offers. Okay. Pulls out a, uh, what it, at first would appear to be a backpack, but then you realize it's made of metal. It's got a face sticking out of it. It's got a flask lid at the top. Slams it down. 4,000 gold. 4,000? Yes. Holy shit. Yes. Alright. Anything else while you guys are here? Uh, I want more. No, I'm poor and I don't want to keep asking someone for money unless I have to. The coin pouch, which uh, is like perfect for what I needed. I'll more wait rock can. to hold rain before I look for what I want to look for. I mean, I don't mind, Rowan, if you want something else. I'm just. Uh... Uh, Rowan's gonna like pull you about five feet away. Alright. Uh, and and whisper to you, listen, I, I have a bit of an issue where I get a bit obsessive with trinkets. Mm hmm So I don't want to just take money. You get what I mean? But I have it. Uh, okay, my good sir, what else do you have? <laughs> <laughs> Listen, that's all the self-control Rowan had. I mean, if you insist. <laughs> It'd be like looking at someone and they're like, listen, I'm trying to stop smoking crack. And you're like, but I have all this crack. And you're like, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> the crack is bad for you and trinkets. I gotta take a look. I mean, do you not remember when she when y'all were going across the river and it's like, oh man, putting your hand in there will make you, you know, get burned real badly. And she was like, ooh, a coin. Do you remember when I did the same thing? We understand each other. <laughs> How fun do you have it? It's okay. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I'm an enabler. <laughs> oh my god. This group tickles me. Alright. Uh, he would uh, shuffle through his, uh, his stuff and he pulls out a, uh, a small ring that has a cork on it. Sets it down on the table. How about this? You, you feeling uh, a little bit parched in the middle of battle, you just bite the cork off, down the potion, you're good to go. Wait, what does the potion do? Whatever the potion you you want to put in there, it's empty right now. I don't make claims for potions I don't make. <coughs> Wait, so it's just like a ring that's the size of a ring with a cork, but it can hold any potion? Yes. Oh, man, that's really tempting. Uh, what do you think, Sona? Um, I mean, I feel like you could just use a flask. Yeah, know, I was thinking the same thing. Anything else? <laughs> this has only become shopping network. It really has been. so fun. Is this what rich people feel like? <laughs> oh, I bet. I hate them. I have a, uh, I have a necklace that summons a, uh, a dog to your side. Can't do any, anything, but it just makes a spectral dog that stays there and is friendly. Wait, wait, is it always the same dog? Yes. So it remembers me? Yes. <gasps> and you said it's a necklace? Yes. Oh my god. Yes. Alright. Well, uh, how much is it? it? Uh, 15 gold. Oh yeah, that's fine. Yay! Okay, that's the last item I'll get. I don't want to get too greedy. <laughs> do you buy things? Uh, sometimes I do. What do you have to sell? You got something to sell? Something interesting? Something nice? Uh, yeah, I have this armor. I'm gonna give him the, the free runner's armor. Sure, one second. <laughs> and nice quality. Look, looks it over. Stretches it a few times. I could offer you thirty gold for this. Yeah, sure. Why not? All right, he takes it. The stuff so they don't need the hands of thirty gold. Anything else? Any other deals you need? Supplies? Extra wagon wheel? Mm -hmm. Extra you cushion any... for your chair, sir? Do you have any bones? Yes. How many did you need? Would you like them bulk or individual? Skull or tibia or rib? Pelvis? Um, Toe? A skull would be cool. Alright, alright. It pulls up a skull. Uh, that'd be uh, four silver. <coughs> It doesn't do anything, it's just a skull. It's just a skull. We have plenty of do bones any bones here. that do anything? I have two that you can use as drumsticks. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Brings out two bones, sets them down. It's gonna be one gold. No, no, no. That was a let's leave. Oh. Well, I'll take my bones back. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta answer that question from that you said to me. There you go. Alright. Anything else from y'all? Alright, I think this is going to be a good place to uh, stop, I might, so I can dish out some uh, <laughs> some items. Lovely. Uh.